Hello, good morning. Corbs here with another Red Dead RP stream as Albert Groves on the Wild RP server. Hope you're having a, a good day. Wherever you may be, if there's anybody lurking. It's 9.01am here on the east side of Australia. I've got a load of washing in the machine, so I've got to keep an ear for that. It's to be good weather. Perfect weather to uh, <laughs> stay inside to be pretending to look for good weather in a video game. Uh, but we are hoping... Um... Oh, so these stay equipped when you log out. I see. Uh, so hope hopefully can um, uh, get some more uh, transit authority training. Oh, that's right. I logged off in Blackwater. Because so we're coming back from the desert. That's right. I remember. But yeah, hopefully, hopefully there's some transit authority... Um, Senior officers around over the next few hours, but um, we may be, maybe in, might just get unlucky, and there may be none around. They may be busy, but that, that will just be how the cookie crumbles. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, I've got some apples on me. I need to go fill up my water one if I can if I come across something on the way. So this is a lot of that's right, it's all alcohol, isn't it? Um the, that's right, the general store has got apples and such. That's right. It's the downside of playing once or twice a week, is it and then there's a big gap in between, is that I am very guilty of um we're getting some things. I don't think I've really spent any time in Blackwater. On this server. Yet. But it looks like it's, um... Is that how it is in the single player? They've got the, like, the construction side down there. I don't know, like, other servers, they edit it. Like Diablo had, sometimes it'd have no building. No, I had that building. What is that that building? Then sometimes add other buildings. I think. Can't remember. Can't remember for sure. It's been ages since I've beaten Blackwater in the single player, so I can't remember what that looks like either. Um, but we might grab some um. Some more apples. So I think it's stacks of four? Stacks of five? Yeah? Good evening! Yo, Snaps! Do you have those construction sites in Blackwater now? Right. It's black water. It's always changing. <laughs> no matter where you are. Um, there's no train station here, is there? Because it's like, it's not even built. By default. Um, so then it's, do we... Um... What would be more likely to be going around today? The west or the east line? I don't see any... Um, I don't see any... Um, it looks like in the transit channel... One of, it looks like one of the senior officers is gauging interest for <laughs> people to people to help out at times that I am not available. Like one is uh, uh, Monday at six a.m. <laughs> no, nope. there's no way I'm get there's no way I'm getting up that early to play a bit of this before work. No, sorry, Bob. 
And then the next one they've got is Tuesday at 7 a.m. my time. I'm like, no, I, I can't do that. So I've got to, I've got to hope that... Um, I've got to hope that... Uh, someone's around today. But uh, if not, that's all right. There's, then there will be tomorrow as well. Uh, uh, but yeah, we will probably want to... We probably want to... I feel like it'd be more... Uh, there's a better chance that the eastern line... Something will happen today. I think the western line, if I remember correctly, was running on Sunday last weekend. But then there were people around on the Saturday on the eastern line. So we'll try that. And then yeah, if I don't fit any formal transit authority training, I'll do some Yeah, you know, I'll do some uh ranch work or and then we'll try again tomorrow, but then let's say oh god, let's say Saturday and Sunday. There's no uh there's no means to do some trans authority training that I may have to inquire about maybe jumping on um, a weeknight that hopefully works for someone else's time zone. Ah! Excuse me. I'm alright, Snaps. I'm um I'm just um I'm just waking up a bit. Like I only just woke up before. Got up, stretched me legs, um, put the load of washing on, and uh, and really booted all this up. Really, I'm all right. Glad it's the weekend. I'm gonna just chill out, play my play this for a bit to this morning, and then later today, keen to keen keen to you know dilly dally, uh, dabble in some um. More Space Marine 2. See if there's anything else I could be doing with Dead Rising. Um, also revisited... Uh, I revisited Age of Empires 2. Definitive Edition. For the first time in a while. The other night with some friends. Which was really cool. So I wouldn't mind maybe just... Revisiting that a little bit more. Just to get back in the swing of it. And then, yeah, just chill out. How, are you? How about yourself? How are you? Ugh. Do, 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 do. Good, it's 6.09 p.m. here. Nice. <laughs> you got the whole night ahead of you. What have you got planned? Wait, was that a... Was that a horse or something floating down from the sky? They didn't. Did you see that? Aliens. Like, boo, bu, 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 bu. It descended upon us. These aren't criminals. To express that Pronghorn has multiple law-abiding civilian-ran businesses with Good him, evening! So he'd be expected to work and report with law. That's when he got uppity and got in my face, John Henry, in parentheses. This was just after talking about stabbing MJ, so I took it upon myself to hold my weapon by my side and ask him politely to step, uh, step back five feet, which he obliged. He made some passive-aggressive comments and ended it with, Be seeing you. 
the people privy to this con the people who were privy to this conversation were Starlick Kane, Thomas Whitney, Tess Cassidy, Nothing Ella new Cassidy, there. Lawrence Reese, and Emmeline Gallagher. Perfect. Oh, sorry. You're all right. Your schedule? Currently, no trains running. Damn. I assume this is the law department? You take care, Mr. Like, Be safe. What about just like sunny? Have a good evening. I'm breaches then. Uh, so there's no train running now, so I guess... I guess we'll pop up to Valentine. Like, we might run into some familiar faces. Like, we had a very interesting time in Valentine last weekend. Around this time. But it might be, like... Let me, like, let's, let's check the time. Let's check the old... Online, international time. So it's currently... So it's just past 7 p.m. In, on the East Coast of America. And then, like, the East Coast, it's, like, just after four. So, I don't know, we might be... There might be... There might be no one doing transit authority stuff because they're, you know, they're, they're having dinner. They're about to have dinner. They've just had dinner, something like that, maybe. Just got to give it, give it a bit of time. We'll see what happens. You got takeout for the family? Nice. Be nice, nice take out dinner with the fam. Oh, oh, God, wolves. He's just a wolf attack. Hi, oh, Turbo Wolf. Thank you for the raid. Hey, Louie. Mate, how you doing? Thank you, mate. Hopefully, hopefully we have a good time today with the old wild RP. Yeah, I don't think those wolves stood a chance, hey? All right. I think that's the law department, but I don't know. What if, it could be a it could be a gang. It could be a gang. I just just want to get to Valentine. Oh, how do you? How you doing? Good friend? evening. Oh, man, good thing we came out here and saved you, right? Me. The other one, I. Oh, I, I, I don't think I had. Any, I did not have any trouble with the wolves, but I'm very lucky. I wasn't down here when all this went down. Oh no! You see, they yeah, were coming right for you, sir. They, they had to come past us. Oh, they were coming for me. They were. What, they were. What did they want with old oh, little old me? Man. Five of them. They were. They were wanting you real bad. Yeah. Oh, good yeah, thing we, we came out here to laugh, stop. And you them. are indebted to us. I can't. I can't believe that. I. I, I didn't. Are I, you calling us liars? No, no. I just. I don't know what I could have done in this or a previous life to uh, antagonize a pack of wolves out this far. Are you may? Are you a man? We, yes. Last I checked. Uh, are you made of meat? Oh, I, I guess technically yes. Then that's offensive to them. They hate it. They take offense to your existence. Your meat. Because it is body. only man that is made in God's image. They do only come out when they're hungry. Otherwise, they still pretty, you know, they stay pretty tucked in their little homes. Oh, so it's quite common that they you're will. You're fine, ladies. You're fine. They, they'll hunt down people and eat them on the regular. You're fine, ladies. Don't worry. We took care of all the wolves. Oh, it's we were just right. killing all the wolves. So, yeah, yeah, we, we just killed all the wolves. Are you guys all right? Down. Down. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you're getting too sad over there. Oh no, I think I recognized two of them. Hello. 
Nice so, to see you again. Sir, How do you do? Since you've been indebted to us, we saved your life. Yo, you have my eternal yeah. thanks, sir. My eternal oh, thanks. I don't live on eternal thanks, sir. Oh, what do you live How on? How are we expected to go get a drink and a stew at the Nine Life Saloon if we... We're destitute. If we're only getting paid in thank yous. How would I ever pay for one of the gals at the Nine Life Saloon on eternal they gratitude? Clean, uh, I suppose well, really, really well. Ladies, do you take eternal gratitude as payment? Um. Uh. <laughs> well, first of all, do, why do you have your bandana on? I've got tuberculosis. <laughs> uh, well, uh... Tuberky. <laughs> Uh, oh, See, no. they don't take eternal gratitude as payment. They sure don't. What if you ask really politely? No. Why don't you try it? Oh, no, I'm I'm on my way to the Valentine bathhouse, so no time to stop, really. Why would we have to ask politely, sir? We have saved your life. Well, <laughs> we prefer gifts, like uh, cut diamonds. <laughs> Oh yeah, do you have any cut diamonds on you? Listen, I have to, I have to, these ladies, we're just looking for some way to pay them, and I am destitute being a, a lone uh, a savior of the, of the wilderness. Oh, you, you want me to pay the ladies? No, I want you to pay me so I can pay the ladies. What, what, what if we just skip the middle, man? Ladies, you're looking absolutely fabulous this evening, and thank you for your thank assistance you, with the wolves. Uh, would you like to uh, for to take my precious sixteen dollars? It's a hundred, honey. Let's see. Oh, I'm not. I'm not looking for any services. I'm just uh, as payment for protecting me from these uh, these ambushing mm. wolves. Uh, um. Well. I don't expect anything else in return. I just want. I. It's, I. I'm picking up. What they're putting down, that uh, it's just some sort of thanks beyond uh, some words would be uh, appreciated. It's, a, it's only one wolf, though. Oh, actually, Albert, I hear more wolves coming. You oh, better pay Lord, us to you sure? More, more wolves? wolves. Oh. Where are they coming from? The high ground or the low ground? Maybe from the brush? Uh, you better stick your hands up and wave so we, they, they know you're innocent. Ah, uh, please, yeah. I'm not like uh, the other meat you like to eat. That, that rhymes. There's a, there's a slogan in there. Albert, I, I think you need to get off the horse. They hate horses. I think They're you attracted do. to it. Oh, good. Oh, 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 you're oh, right. Oh, I'm meat oh, upon oh, meat. Stay here, ladies. Come follow me, Albert. Yeah, go, go follow C over there. We'll Come you. on. We'll Who? Come this way, right here, sir. With the with the go to the feather man. A man with feather the mask man. that looks like a, a yeah, lumberjack. Yeah. Are we going to a, a, a safe house or something? Yes, yes. Yeah. Oh thank God! <laughs> Lucky Family there's a safe house just over this rise. Have to check your pockets. We have to check your pockets for a weight limit. Oh, if you want, I can tell you what uh, what's in there. Don't worry, you... sir. We've got it. <laughs> All right. Well, he's got money and a gun. There you look. There, see. Is there? Is there? Is it gonna be good? <laughs> Not really. All right, let me, I, let me check. I'm a simple man, just trying to, just I trying to earn my way through the transit authority. <laughs> He's got nothing. All right. Nothing. Okay, I've so spent sixteen dollars right there. Nothing, and you will accept that oh you have nothing. Oh my God, Albert! Come and run, run! We'll hold them Albert, off. Run, run, we'll hold Albert, them run! Run, run! Oh, where do I run to? I reckon it's um it's the two guys that two of them are the two guys that mugged me last week. I'm pretty sure. I re think I recognise the bald one with the big moustache. And then um, <laughs> and then, yeah, I think the other one that hey. robbed me. Hey. Hello. You're what's happening? They told they told me to run. They told me the the wolves were coming back. I think it, it was a robbery or something. A what? No, it was not a robbery. I'm, I'm so confused what happened. A robbery? No, they, they were... Um, they uh, they preemptively stopped 
some uh, ambushing wolves before I came uh, down the road. Uh, and it, and then I, I just, I, I'm unfamiliar with a lot of the customs in this country. Like, I know tipping is a thing, and I suppose if someone rescues, rescues you, you've got to tip them as well. I, I, I don't have really have much money. I've, I've only just started training with the Transit Authority. But yeah. this seemed like an extortion. This seemed horrible. Yes. I was very afraid. An ex what? It is extortion. They ask you money for nothing. Oh, but I didn't get mauled by wolves. I wouldn't say it's n nothing. Uh, I'm so confused. Me too. I am as well. Are, are you suggesting that that they just used the wolves as an excuse to try and get uh, funds out of me? I thought they were going to shoot us. I don't know what you yeah. think, sir. Oh no no no! I don't I I don't I don't think they 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 they, they take, seem to take a liking to you. I don't think they. It, it would be very ungentlemanly to to shoot some some ladies like that. Huh. Well, what do we do now? I'm. Well, I suppose if the coast is clear, I better get back there and get uh, my old horse Growler. He's probably wondering where the bloody hell I am. Do you... Do you where you, is your horse? Oh, indeed. Sir. Oh, he's uh, back over where the, uh, the the guns were firing. Um, he's just he's back over there. Where, where are you ladies heading to anyway? Blackwater. Oh, you're not too far off. I just I just came from there and then I feel like I, I blinked and then now I was here. Um... Do you usually like you're wearing very exquisite outfits riding around the countryside? Do you you don't have um, anyone that could give you a lift with a wagon? Oh goodness! Oh, oh dear sir! <laughs> it's a oh, shame. Like going... I said, I've just started uh, training last week uh, in the transit authority on how to uh, run the, uh, the carriages and the trains and whatnot. Oh. Uh, a couple of well-dressed ladies like yourself would definitely be welcome to. Uh, Climb aboard those and, you know, make sure those your hair and your dresses are kept nice and tidy. Mm. I'll just... <laughs> I don't know. I think we'll be fine. I need to... Where is the most close bank? Closest bank. I think it's Troubery. I believe I saw a, a bank in Blackwater, miss. Yeah, but if I take this way, I can go to Strawberry. Where's your horse again? Uh, it's just over here. Let me just <laughs> put the pipe away. Yeah, we saw, we saw your horse. Just don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to go wasting the tobacco. I'll, I'll lift. I'll lift up the pay. All right, knees up. Oh dear. <laughs> Do you often uh, practice the sports, sir? No, no. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to getting on the back of my horse again. This is this is tucking me out. But I suppose this is it's quite excellent. Whew. I'm really not in the suitable attire for all this cross country running. Oh. Sir. 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 Oh, you saw Growler? Indeed. I did stand the hill. Growler, old boy, where are you? Whistle. Oh, there you go. There he is. Oh, thank you. Ladies, thank you very much for the escort back to Growler. Thank you very much. Uh, would you like a, just a, a, a escort into Blackwater, or are you, are you right from yeah. here? Yeah. Yes, you can join us. Well, I suppose if there's no transit authority ha training happening now, I better make my own, I suppose. Oh, what is your name again? Uh, Groves. Oh, Albert Groves, at your service. Albert Groves? Yes, yes, Albert Groves. And, and, and your names, ladies? Eleonore. Penelope Campbell. Oh, goodness, very fancy names. Lovely to meet you. Nice to meet you, sir. It's very nice meeting you. It's good. Uh, and uh, the accents, am I detecting a, a French accent there? Indeed. Ah, yes. Our friends from France across the pond. Yes, I'm, I'm from England from a couple of weeks ago. It's nice to meet some fellow Europeans. Yes. Penelope is, is English as well. Oh! Oh, from where do you hail, miss? Uh, 
to London, indeed. Oh yes, I'm I'm fresh from London myself. Uh, there's much too much too much uh, competition with the trains over there, so I figured try my luck here in the new world. Uh, and uh, what do you both uh, do with your with your free time? Get drunk. Get drunk. <laughs> yeah, we like to enjoy ourselves. And I hope you're not paying for these drinks. Most of the time we pay until a nice man pay for us. Oh, surely that won't take too long on the average night. Maybe a little bit, a bit of patience. That would go unheard of if you two ladies are buying all your drinks all night, every night. That would be just, I would be wondering, where are the gentlemen? Where the bloody hell are they? Well, the, yeah, we, that's a good question. Maybe yeah, they're in Blackwater. They might be waiting there right now. Full Probably pockets, ready to go. Me. Oh, here we are. This is just left down here. Nearly get you there, safe and sound. Unofficial Transit Authority security. Thank you so much, Mr. Gross. Yeah. I oh. just need to go to the bank very quick. I have a lot of money on me. Oh, it's no problem at all. Happy to help. <laughs> Excuse me. There was a man on that horse. You sure? I thought it was a dead end. Oh, it had a gun. There's that wagon again. It's just sitting there. Why is it? It's, if he's not using it, I can use it. It's scandalous. What <laughs> if <laughs> they just get drunk? We might be on a side quest. Do 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 do. A job well done. <laughs> was it uh, Penelope and was it Aluna? I just calcul calculated and I've made a hundred sixty dollars today. Uh, not today, oh. sorry, not today, this week, this week. <laughs> Very well done. Right. Uh, well, it was nice meeting you. Likewise. Okay. You ladies will be all right from here? Yeah, yeah, no worries about that. Thank you very much for your help. Very, very welcome. Have a lovely day. You too. Thank you, you so care. much. Farewell. What she says she made 160 bucks. Doing what? <laughs> All right. Let's go to Valentine. <laughs> I'm having trouble remembering names, recognizing characters. That was nice. They were nice. That was funny. And then I'm pretty sure, <laughs> pretty sure, two of those guys in that group. Were the ones that robbed me yes, uh, last week, so we maybe we'll run into some law and be like, "Those guys, they're around." Uh, was it? Uh, I can't remember his name. I cannot remember his name. Hello, Hammer. Good morning, mate. I'm good, man. Just <laughs> had a had a a big bit of RP just there. Uh, nearly got robbed again, but they're like, "This guy's got nothing," and then. Some ladies came by that all like you know, I'll escort you back into town. So I've had to really get into the get into the voice quite heavily quite quickly. So I'm a bit <laughs> But it was fine, I'm good. How you going, man? You feeling better? But yeah, we nearly got we nearly got robbed again, but um it's because I have I've got sixteen dollars. I've just got like a pile of tobacco leaves in my pockets. I've got just like newspaper less so I got I got nothing. That's funny. But now I can say now Albert can say that he's done some uh 
some unofficial transit authority security work. Ah, what? what? What did you do, Albert? What did you do? Oh, I escorted two pretty ladies back into Blackwater. All on my own, yes. Absolutely smashing. You would believe the journeys we went on. You still recovering, man? Just chilling? Well, I hope it's a... I hope it's a... Uh, a restful weekend for you. I've heard there's um, more people around getting sick. And I'm just like, please, no one get me sick. Can I just get through the first few weeks of October <laughs> without getting sick and then, and then lay it on me? Big two weekends. Oh, what do you got on, mate? Popping up the last bit. Yeah, I know that feeling. Sometimes you can, you almost can feel that it's, um, you, you, it's almost like you feel like, you know, it's one, one last cough will expel the last of it, but it just takes its time, doesn't it? What was that guy's name? Free wedding party tonight. And brother's wedding next weekend. Damn. Yeah, no, you're not, you're not kidding. You are not kidding. Yeah, that's going to be a lot. I wonder if we'll, in Valentine, we'll come across that group that love to, uh, do the backflips. <laughs> we might, yeah, we might run into them. Uh, we might run into, uh, the bathhouse staff. We might run into, uh, was it Drew? Was it Drew? Oh, what was his name? The crazy guy that was like, why don't you just go bath yourself? You disgust me. And, well, and he's, <laughs> he's crazy wild. It was so funny. I think we might run into that guy. What was his name? I can't remember everyone's names. It's really difficult. Drew Drew oh, oh, I can't remember Sure we'll find out though Drew Sharp? Do, 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 do. Trail of brown egg. What? I'm gonna check Mama Christine in. I'm gonna check her in. I will hold the trail of you. Time to check Chuck. 
<laughs> you're gonna say something. Mama, your boyfriend's your mama, your boyfriend's down here. Oh, tell him good night. I'll go to bed. Is this the line for the bot? Uh, pardon me, sir. Excuse you. Who are you? Uh, my name is Mr. Groves. Is this the line for the bath? Uh, yeah. Uh, nope, it's not. You gotta, you gotta go down there. We'll take care of you here in just a minute. All right. Yes, yes. We'll be I right with you. How many is up there? Oh, All right. Hold on. Oh. You, were, you were gonna say something. Uh, <laughs> would you like to wipe your feet off on me? Oh, what the bloody hell? I thought you were a rug. Wait, wait. You're not the guy Mama just took on a date? Who? No, no. I just, I just arrived on from Blackwater. Ricky's down there, and this is Who the bloody hell are you? Oh, I'm Ricky the rug. <laughs> What? I could have sworn you were the guy. He said he was gonna be right back, and he, I thought you changed clothes. No, no. I, who, right. who? Who's it, Mama? Welcome, welcome to the bathhouse. How can we help you today? Uh, do I? Do I stand on Ricky the Rug? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Hey, all right. I'm glad I checked. Uh, hello. My name is Albert Gross. Ow. I, Ow. Oh. Are you all right, Shut Ricky? Up, Ricky. Mm. Uh, I was here yes. last weekend, and I met some of the staff here, which uh, yes. seemed seemed great. So it's been a it's been a hell of a week, and I'm in dire need of a bath. Okay, would you like a bath with one of our master bathers, or do you want to uh, go solo with it? Oh, I could definitely use some help after the week I've had. I could definitely use the help. All right. Well, that will be $15. You can pay it to Penny right here, and we will uh, escort you to the bathroom and bathe you properly. Sounds good. Yeah. Was that $15 hey. to the lady here? Yes. Uh -huh. Hey, hey, Cabbage. Yeah? Do you have that um, that thing that we, we used to do? You know, the oh. what was it, the gramophone or whatever? I could turn the grammar off if that's what you want. Yeah, I think I think this fellow needs a little music while no. while he's relaxing. You I mean, having uh, trouble? My uh, grammar yes. phone might be different. All right. That's all right. Just trying to give all the options we can. All right. Well, sorry, sorry, Miss. I uh, I closed my pocket okay. by we mistake. Can... Oh, okay. All right. Let's try that again. I know how to accept a trade. Was this a, is this a detective guy? If not, I can... Oh, there it is. Sassy, you know. There we Thank go. You. There we go. Got He's there in the end. paid up. I got it. All right, right this way. Poor oh, Ricky. Ricky the rug! Should I be a rug inside? Uh, yeah, Ricky, come on, be a rug inside the bath. Just any, uh, uh, this yeah, one? Just, yeah, just go in there and oh. take off your pants and jacket. Right. Yep, yeah. and the rest <laughs> of your clothes, too, because you just don't. We'll just look away, that way we don't see your bits and bobs. Uh, don't keep that <laughs> Keep that on. Uh, is the... Oh God! When you get out, you can you can dry your feet on me. There we All go. Right. I'm in the top. All right, let's give him a good bath here. So, uh, why don't you? Tell us about your day. How's it going so far? Oh, goodness, I, uh, I woke up in Blackwater and I uh, went out to investigate to see if there was any transit authority training happening. No sign of it, so I thought, oh, let's ride on up to uh, to Valentine and see what's going on, see if I can run into familiar faces. And, uh, oh, oh, yeah, my legs are, well, thanks for the assistance with the leg there. I uh, did a lot of running. I ran into a, well, I nearly ran into a pack of wolves on the road, but this group, they uh, 
they uh, they managed to preemptively put them down so that I didn't come to any harm. And then, unfortunately, I didn't have uh, anything of value to pay them back with. So, um, but then I had to do a spot of running because uh, they suddenly said, look out, Albert, they're coming back. Run for it. So I ran over the hillsides. And there are these two lovely ladies, uh, Penelope and uh, El Ella Eleanor or something. Um, she was very kind, and they, I escorted them back into town. And now I'm here. So it's been a, it's been a, it's been a quite the day. Is, does the uh, the dancing uh, assist with the bathing? Oh, and Ricky's here too. Ricky the rug. It really completes the room, I think. Oh, goodbye, miss. Oh, everybody, everyone's gone awfully quiet. <laughs> Hello? Oh, no, sir. I don't seem to be able to hear you right now. I can't, I can't hear anyone. <laughs> oh my God, what the hell? This is quite a, it's quite the operation. This <laughs> got Ricky the rug. I can't hear him, is it because I'm in the tub? Uh, he is full of soap. Oh dear, I think you may have, uh, I think, I think the expression is to wash behind the ears, not, not f fill them with soap. <laughs> Ricky the rug. This is cursed, man. This is cursed. Well, the way they're like, you pay the lady and we'll get you to your bar. It's just, the lady leaves and you go, like, this guy. You got a guy with a rug. Oh, hello, Ricky. I'd say it's because I'm in the in the bath. Um, smacks my side of his head. Oh, ah, Ricky, be careful! Ah, our oh, team speakers disconnected. Oh, I see. Why did team speak? Oh goodness. We do that. Oh Oh good job, Ricky. I, I can hear them again now. There you go. Yeah, we started the gramophone. Sorry about that. I just yeah, I think just too much soap got into my ears too quickly. Would you yeah. like to hear a song while get in there. Get, get in there. Oh, back in the tub? Oh, get back of in course. the tub. Of course. in the bathtub, soaking up big soot. Scrub your body, scrub your butt. Scrub your underarms. So that, that's the gramophone playing in the other room, is it? Yep. Oh, yeah. uh, may I ask who's who's singing on that piece of music? It's a uh, mayor, mayor Cambridge. M the the mayor sang on on that. Yeah, he recorded these uh, songs. He went to this place Would and. Would you like to hear another song while you may? Answer. Good. I must say, Ricky the Rock really really completes the room. He does tie it together. I'm just, a, I'm just a rug. 
I mean, like, you know, you definitely, when you're in a room with a, an exquisite rug, you don't really pay much attention to it because it's it's come to be expected. It completes the room. But then you really feel, you really feel when you're in a room with lacking a rug, it really goes, really catches your attention because you think, well, what? there's just no rug, is there? The yeah. thing about a rug is you're not even All supposed right. to notice it's there and you step on it. We need to give it. you some more bubbles here. <gasps> oh, it's an actual proper bubble bar. Goodness, he's really going for it, isn't he? <gasps> Sir, are you yeah. all right? Like, I, I really yeah. appreciate the effort I'm for the extra. Like, the extra bubbles is definitely appreciated, but I don't want you to, uh, you know, be taking the rest of the day off because you've hurt yourself. Oh no, I'm professional as hell. No, it's, it's definitely. Um, I'm definitely feeling much more cleaner, and uh, you know, the the music was a nice touch. Ricky the rug completes the room. It's just uh, the lady. The lady yeah. just takes the money, does she? Would you like to hear another song while you're in the bath? <laughs> Good. Here's a little ditty written For the most part, yes, yeah, it is. Here's a little ditty. Yo, there is a potato on my feet. Pardon? Oh! Ladies, ladies, why don't you play these <laughs> Oh, that was... There's someone behind that's, the that's thing the, there. That's the track that always... It's scratched. It skips a lot. Ow, you're... You're stepping on my feet. Yep, I'm just trying to relax your leg muscles there. Uh, I, after uh, all the sprinting I've done today, I don't know if trotting on they, my uh, leg... They, Who they the bloody hell is that? Broke. It's a, it's okay, cabbage. It's a. Don't bro. We'll, we'll just uh, we'll, we'll work on it and get. And get Wait, it. this is the okay. mayor. Yeah. Yeah. What? Hey, Why? He runs the gramophone. D aren't you supposed to be running a town? I mean, what does it look like? Mayor. I'm doing. I'm hey. helping out. We're the number one suppose, business in this place. I suppose yeah, leading a town is helping people from all the way from the bottom all the way to the top. That's right. Damn. Gotta go from the bottom to the top. Jesus Christ. There you go. All right. Let's see here. Uh, how much more uh, bathing is required until I'm squeaky clean? Well, a couple of hours. Come yeah, on. I, mean, I just kind of add one more thing. Couple of hours. Yeah, you're in here for the long haul. Oh, God. This All is right. so cursed. See, uh... And what's that you've got there? Well, it's a uh, yeah, it's just a little little thing we like to add to people. The fuck is mustard? I'm gonna pack? hold my hand above your head and remove all the negative energies from you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I, I, it's almost like I've completely forgotten to think about anything uh, negative. Ah, anything that, negative that may have recently happened to me. All I can really think about is what on earth was that? Yeah, it's some mustard powder that we it's called uh, a lady. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean it's you know, but I mean, it makes you feel feel better and smell better. I, I hope so. <laughs> it's tickling my nose. Yeah, it does that sometimes. All right. Well, you got a towel and uh, your clothes are hung up right there. So just uh, take your time, and when you're ready, you can come out. All right. Uh, thank you. 
Uh, I would uh, I would give your uh, pockets like a couple of hours. I was spitting in them. My my pants. my pants pockets. Yeah, I was I had to spit somewhere, so I was spitting in your pockets. Well, that's that dry the... up in a couple of hours. That, that doesn't sound ideal. Could we quickly soak them in the tub? No, your bath time's over. Oh, I, oh, that's, I see. That's true. You have to pay extra for that. Yeah. All right. Take your time. Feel free to dry your feet on uh, me. Oh, yeah. I suppose I don't want to go slipping over on the on the boards or anything. One one moment. What the fuck? Hey. 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 What on earth? Uh, dries feet on the rug. There we go. There we go. The soles of the feet nice and dry. Thank you, Ricky. Oh, 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 oh. <sighs> Are you alright down there? Are you okay up there? I'm doing just fine. Oh, well, I... I... I suppose that's it. Are your feet it, dry? Oh, okay. Yeah, I've set my boots, boots back now? on. I... Okay, are they clean? If they're not, you can, you can wipe them off on me as well. Last thing I wanted was, you know, if my feet were still damp, and then if, you know, and then if I put my socks back on immediately, that's the last thing I want. Like, wet socks is just, that's not ideal. Well, that's what I'm here for, to dry everything off. I appreciate that very much, Ricky. Now, do, do I... Will you make your way back to the, uh... Well, don't worry about me. Just head to the front counter and, and uh, you know, give your, um... Give your rating of how many stars. Oh, oh, rating. Okay. Yeah. Oh, right, thank I'll, you again, I'll, Ricky. I'll, yeah, don't worry about me. What the fuck? That was... That was very cursed. <laughs> what is this guy doing? Uh, still gonna figure the wood man out. Been working on it. Oh, he comes re <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That, that Would you true. like your bath, sir? Uh, it, it was definitely, it was different. It was, it was, the main thing is I'm cleaner than I was, I think. That's good. Well, that, yeah, I mean, that's, that's what we aim for. Um, I, yeah, I guess I have some things to think about, but yeah, I, uh, $15, you know, we got there in the end and, uh, uh, thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome, you know, I mean, come back and see us and we'll take care of you. All right. Well, I best be off to see if I can get some work done, but, uh, have a good night. Have All right, night. you have a good night as well. Don't let your meat loaf. I, I'll certainly try. All right. <laughs> uh, what? What in the seven hells? Ah. That was cooked, man. Um, let me check the what. Oh, okay. There's, there's still no. Unfortunately, there's still no um. Transit authority things going on. <laughs> I thought maybe, it, hopefully, there would be by now. Hopefully, we would have killed some time. That's a shame. Um. Goodness gracious. Well, technically, Squid, that was the that's the first bar uh Albert has had. That's that's the first uh I don't know if it's gonna be the first of many. I didn't even realize that the like the gramophone it's like, is the guy standing behind the thing? Oh. Oh, no. Well, 
Oh, dude, is that was that a server reset or was that um was that just a on my end? So we're in live about an hour. So my washing should nearly be ready to be put out on the line. Always forget how long the average, how long it needs on average. We just got a great message. Just learned that my friend Witchy was approved for a creator pass at South by Southwest Sydney. That's awesome. So she can um she can get a refund on her on the pass she bought, I imagine. Hell yeah. Smelly eggshell fragments. They mentioned a detective. Were they talking about that Drew guy? Maybe underneath all the craziness, maybe he's just a undercover detective or something. Yeah, I imagine um, if your people might let their guard down or something. If you, you're acting all crazy, you never know what they might reveal. They might get too comfortable. 339. Yeah, around the back of a house here, there's somewhere you can... You can fill up your your canteen. I'm trying to remember where that is. May as well while I'm here because they seem to indicate that I think it's on the other side actually. They seem to indicate that that was the uh, the cleanest water source in Valentine, and I feel like that is what 
Albert would be seeking out. The cleanest water possible. Oh, and there, there goes the washing machine. Right, uh, let's find some water. Uh, and I'll find a spot to... To sit down. Oh, there it is. Lean against the wall. All right, I will be very quick. I will run to. Um, I just got to get my washing out of the machine, hang it up outside, and I will be right back. Hopefully, it'll be fine. All right, washing is out. Okie dokie. Sorry about that. I am back. Washing is out on the line. Whew. Um, let me take another quick look at the. Is there anyone at the transit authority right now? No. Really hoping to fit in some more Transit Authority training this weekend. But it is a roll of the dice. Partner? Good evening! Oh, even there? I was just wondering if I could uh, bend the ear of one of you real quickly. Uh, yes. Uh, let, me, let me just come out right there. Let me help you with. Uh, look, I've just, um, I had a bit of a 
uh, situation last weekend where I was mugged, uh, essentially mugged just outside of town by two gentlemen. Uh, and then just today, uh, on my travels between Blackwater and Valentine, I may have uh, I may have come across the same two gentlemen who were, if if I'm remembering correctly, two ladies that came by described it as possible extortion. I see. So there was uh, so last weekend there was two gentlemen. One was bald. He had a a, a darker tan than the other gentleman and a, a unkempt moustache, and the other one well, I can't really remember him right now but I, I sort of the way he carried himself but uh, then then this and then just today just before traveling from blackwater i believe i saw the same bald man and he was accompanied by there was another gentleman uh, wearing like a blue a blue uh, scarf or something covering his face and they were they were joined by a couple of uh, companions on the road but um basically uh, I witnessed uh, wolves attacking their group. They put down the beasts, and then as I approached, they uh, they were very quick to exclaim how, oh, we saved you from the wolves. We protected you. You know, we could uh, really use some thanks uh, beyond words. And uh, then they they forcibly checked my pockets, couldn't find anything of value, and then um, seemed quite disappointed. And, yeah, two, two lovely ladies uh, that rode past, um, they were very confused by the situation. They described it as a, they 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 used the word extortion. So I fear, I fear that the these two men that caused some trouble last week maybe maybe caused a bit of ruckus today as well. I see. Um, could you give me your name real quick? Albert Groves. Albert Groves. And then I had a lot of trouble remembering. He one of them last week. They dro he, he dropped his name. I don't know if it was intentional or accidental, but I mean, it was something like uh, Oscar, Oscar, uh, Oscar Wilde, Oscar Wiggly, Oscar, uh, something like that. Oscar W something. I see. Was definitely with a W last name, right? Or could it have been anything? I'm fairly sure, but yeah, last week's uh, running with them was a lot more traumatic than today, which I'm very thankful for. Well, I am glad that they did not rob you, but it sounded like they pilfered through your pockets today, so they were definitely wanting to. They mentioned something yeah. about they were hoping I had some uh, cut diamonds or something, but yeah, I, I'm just a simple. I've just I've just started training last week with the transport authority. I, I I've got nothing of value, just just the clothes on my back. But there there may be a uh, there was a. I believe it was a, I can't remember. She was a senior, uh, a senior, a senior deputy, or she was a sheriff or something. Uh, last week, uh, she took my report uh, in the in the tavern there about it. So I don't know. She might have more information. I can't remember her name. Um, I have it here as uh, Deputy Reese. Reese. I think that might be her. But yeah, she was lovely. She definitely put my mind at ease. I felt a lot safer. It did. She was very good at listening. But I'm sorry. I'm so, I wish I had more information for you. I just thought I'd better. I've just been mulling it over, and I figured I'd better let you know because yeah, there's not long after I told her last week. Uh, it seemed like a couple of the old law enforcement really banded together and they headed out. It sounded like these two men had been causing a number of troubles that day, and it was really just the tip of the iceberg. And so it's just, yeah, I just figured I'd be, better give you the heads up in case you weren't aware that they, they may be on the loose. Understood. Um, I'll check around for any similar reports and see if we can try to identify these fellows. But one of them, I, I'm fairly sure I recognized him. Uh, you know, your black pants, black shirt, uh, suspenders, uh, 
darker tan than, say, yourself there, bald, and then a, just a, you know, a, not a well-kept moustache like myself or yours, you know, a, a, a long, unkempt one that would cover his lips. I would, I'd be, at, at this point, I, 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 I think I'd be able to spot him anywhere. I, I feel like it was one of them. This is last week, they, they took $40, and then they made me fight one of them to hopefully win it back. And of course they... They really gave me a... Gave me the old one, too. Very well. Well, I've uh, noted down what you've said. Hopefully we can... Try to get back to you on if... We can uh, identify these fellows. We do. I believe we might. I might. I will have to follow up with Reese, but there might be a suspect. Oh, good. Well, I, I hope if um, if it ever comes to it, and you need uh, someone to identify them, uh, definitely feel free to contact me. And if I'm available, because I, I feel like one of them I could definitely point out in a crowd. I think he may have been the one I fought. I just, it Very just, well. it just feels a little, I'm like I, I, I needed a bath already, but I, it definitely reinforced why I needed a bath just now, because just the fact that they, they used, uh, you know, killing some wolves as an excuse to try and get a monetary reward from me, just, it doesn't seem very honest at all. No, sounds like the, uh, slimy type. Uh, so, well, that you get. Well, yeah, I hope, I hope, safely. It, I hope, it, uh, hope it is some help, gentlemen. Uh, Godspeed. Yes, yes, you have a good day, Mr. Groves. You too. Good morning. I can't remember the guy's name. Is Oscar? Oliver? Something W? I just can't remember. I think I went and checked the VOD just to be like, what did he say? And I can't even remember that. Like, I went and checked. I have no idea. It escapes me. Um... Give me a sec. Right. Um, let's check the Transit Authority stuff again. No, still nothing. Damn. No. No. They may all be busy tonight. <laughs> I say, oh boy, you might be in need of a bath. Our team speak is closed again. Morning, friend. I say, old boy, you may be in need of a bath. What'd you say to me? I was saying, have you visited the bathhouse down on the corner? I will always smack you across your damn little mouth over there. Shove that damn pipe down your neck. Well, I, I meant no offense. You mind your damn business, you motherfucker. I'm terribly sorry, sir. I meant, I meant no offense. 
And then I'd advise you to fuck off and get out of my face. Right, off, off the fuck I go. <laughs> More <in there. laughs> Joy! I suppose yeah, that's what I get for me. Like you should probably have a, you could have a bath. <laughs> Gee, whoo! That was a little scary. at the bath guy on oh, there's the is it the mech cabbage what if I could tell him to grab that guy for a bath Morning. like might go check the telegram oh wait I'm forgetting a key Beginning a key thing. It's you know I don't just jump in the the voice chat so they can see that I'm online. I gotta send a. I gotta send a tip. I gotta send a telegram on the tip line. Oh, I forgot. That's what I've been forgetting to do. I gotta send that because then that might ping them in game. Morning. Like they might not be checking Discord. Oh my god. Damn it! I, f I knew I forgot something. Damn it. That's all right. It's good to do some other stuff first anyway. Uh, all right. What, what's the what's the instructions again? Please connect to the voice channel whenever you're available for training as well as send a tip to the trans... Oh, I knew I forgot something. He was terrifying. He's very he was very committed to the to the role there. Imagine a character like that getting a bath service like like we received before. Now that's that's an interaction I want to see. That would be hilarious. I can't believe I forgot to send a telegram about it. Oh, better late than never. Oops. Good morning, Mrs. Phenom. Uh, it's um, it's had its it's had its own uh, a few little things. <laughs> There's been some um v. There's been some um some funny things have happened. So we we nearly got robbed again. Uh, and I believe I recognize one of the guys from last week. And I believe the other guy from last week was, um, he was wearing a, a disguise. But of course, Albert doesn't, isn't sure of that. Um, they, they were with a group and they, um, they killed some wolves. And then they were like, oh yeah, we just saved you from the, from those wolves. Yeah. Yeah. Like we could really use, you know, a reward for helping you. And then these two ladies came by and they're like, I think they're extorting you. And yeah, they checked my pockets and um, they couldn't find anything of value. So they sort of let it go. 
Um, and then we we helped those, we escorted those two ladies to Blackwater. Uh, and then I um, then we visited the Valentine bathhouse. We had the first bath, which was um, very cursed. Um, the main thing is that Albert was clean, became clean at the end of that, one way or another. Uh, and then we went and we reported to the local law enforcement that, uh, we believe one of the guys that was trying to extort myself earlier was causing trouble last week. And they've, they've noted that down. They believe, they, I think they've got a suspect. So, Morning. uh, yeah. And then I, I have just realized I forgot Morning. to send a telegram to the transit tip line. Um, so hopefully we hear something back. But if not, then that's on me because I should have sent that like an hour ago. I forgot. I thought I just had to jump in the voice chat just so they could see me in the Discord. But I think they might not be checking Discord. It's better to send the, uh, the telegram in game because then they'll, if there's someone around, they'll get it. So uh, that is my, that's my mistake. But I'm just trying to remember the name of the... He said his name last week. He was like, Oscar. It was Oscar or Oliver. And then something starting with W. Did you catch it, Mrs. Phenom? I just... I went back and checked. But then I can't... Rem I can't even remember what I checked. Quigley? Well, yeah, I kind of described to the law enforcement. I was like, it's something like Oscar Wiggly, something like that. That's all we can really do. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I went and I went and looked. So Albert doesn't know this, but I went and looked. Um, his real name is Oscar Quill, with one L. Um, and it, I think he streams as well. If anyone is interested in checking out that, um, yeah, it's Quill. But yeah, I I can only ever remember like Quigley or like Wild Sign. Like I always forget that it's Quill. Oh, I'll be back in a minute. You do look very handsome, but why are you mixing different patterns like that? Because Charlie Hustle does whatever the fuck he wants. Does what? Dolores does too. Shut yeah, your well, home. Uh, well, Dolores.
Sorry about that. Um... I suppose we might have to do what we did uh, last week and just keep an eye. I keep popping, keep visiting the telegram station. I'm gonna knock some know-how into that blockhead of his someday. Well, I'll be there. Howdy, friend. Sometimes I can't tell if it's a. NPC or a player talking. The government's talking about regulating hunting? Don't make no damn sense. How's a man supposed to eat? Yeah. But if after a bit of time we don't, um... We don't hear anything back, we'll go do some... Uh, might go visit, uh... Oh, I see what's happening. Um, so I, I think last week it didn't take too long for a reply, but that's, that's, yeah, that's if someone's around. I feel like the, the walking slowly with the pipe helps just to kill some time, give them... Give him a give him more of a chance to uh, reply. <laughs> we don't want to run down and miss it. Yeah, it might be too soon. All right, we might ride down to uh, Saint Denis. Just see what's going on around there. There might be some theater things happening. Yeah, bugger. Bugger, 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 bugger. I thought I moved far away for enough. I thought I was far enough away from the building. For there to be no mishaps with this. Um. Where's the. Where's the. Yeah, we'll go see what's happening in Saint Denis. There might be something, um. going on. If we can run into some theatre people, maybe we'll get closer to. that fabled audition. then if there's nothing really happening around the Saint Denis area, might go do some, um, 
farm chores to kill some time. Maybe we'll go pick some oranges again real quick. See if we come across the orange mafia. Oh. <laughs> You're picking some oranges, eh? <laughs> think you think you can come here and uh pick up pick up pick our oranges, huh? I'm just nervous to do to go racing and to do more farm chores because um because of how how unlucky I've been with the chicken feeding activity. It always, I always seem to I don't know is it is it me breaking it or is it just or is the chicken feed just a bit scuffed? I, just, I always ruin it and then I lose all that all that work. Wasted. Before we go to farm stuff, if we if we do that, uh, if there's nothing happening, they need might pop through roads actually, because the people there seem to be a good fit for Albert Groves to, to chat with. I'll be right back again.
<laughs> hey, Steve. Love me some grabs, you know? <laughs> How you going, mate? We had our first, um, we had our first bath before. We nearly got robbed again by the same guys, I think. And we are hoping, hoping some, uh, transit authority stuff happens. But I forgot to, I forgot to send a telegram at the start. So oh, I'm hoping we haven't missed anyone. But, you know, it's, you know, maybe, I don't know, maybe just need a bit of time. We'll see. We'll see. Hopefully I haven't missed them. But they might be busy. They might, because it's their, because it's their Friday night. They, you know, they might have, they might have stuff on. Which is fair. <laughs> Damn time zone differences. I hope, you, I hope you've had a good week, man. <laughs> Imagine having a life. What's that? I can probably count on one or two hands how many times I have a life per year lately. <laughs> <laughs> When's your birthday again? But yeah, dude, Pax will be here before we know it. Like, October is next week, which is wild. And yeah, it'll... The first week or whatever of October will fly by. And the next thing we know, we'll all be in Melbourne. October 3rd! Ah! Right. Okay. Giddy up. How's WoW going? It's been great to see everyone again. <sighs> you around here, isn't it? Yeah, we get a fair amount of folks coming in. How you doing, show? Good evening. Good evening. Anything I can get for you? Oh, nothing in particular. I was just stopping through Saint Denis while uh, heading around to see what's going on. Was anything interesting happening in Saint Denis today? Now, well, there's always interesting things happening here. Would you happen but, to know uh, any theatre uh, interesting things? Any interesting theatre things? Um, I believe that the. Th Theatre people have not been around today. I've not seen them. Are you familiar with anybody that uh, runs out of the theatre? Sir, you look like you might need this. I've met just a couple. I don't need it. And uh, just, it's been very hard to uh, find, you know, lock in a, yeah, an audition or anything. But I'm right. just, it's not urgent. Now, but would you have happened to have heard of any uh, transit authority movements today Looks as like well? You use that. Yes, I did see the train going around yeah, earlier. Sure do. Um, but that was about. Of course. Let me know if you ever need anything. Four or five hours ago. Oh. I'll see you later. Yeah. Take it easy, Mr. Oliver. Good to meet you. Thank you. Take care. How's it going? Oh. Here, I'll get out of your way, please. I'm. I'm just. I'm just passing through. Sorry, sir. I had a little trouble hearing you there. What? What'd you say? Oh, yeah, that's all right. Thank you, sir. Uh, yeah, I'm just not, passing. Not you, Mr. Albert, sorry. Oh, yes, uh, Mr. Groves, yes. I'll, I'll just um, re relax for a moment before I continue on my way, I think. Okay. Sorry, what, what, what were you saying, pal? Been better. I can see that. Um, anything I can get for you? Yeah, sure thing. Just tell me. Okay. Oh, All excuse right. me. You go, my friend. Oh, 
Try reaching out to me. There you are. Whatever you can spare. Thank you. All right. Yeah, well, quick recovery there and enjoy the meal. Yeah, hey, I'll try. Say, we met in uh, in Valentine a while back. Well, maybe not a while back, but, you know, within the last week or so, didn't we? Uh, what, was, what, was, what was your name again? Mr. Barletti. Mr. Barletti. I, I can't remember for sure, but, yeah, I have been frequenting Val Valentine quite often. I think when they do like rubs ear, touches ear, it means that they're like reconnecting to TeamSpeak or something, or they can't hear you. <clears throat> Apologies. Um, That's all right. Yeah, I believe Valentine, you were uh, you were looking for a doctor as I was riding into town. Um, oh. Uh, uh, yes, did you? Was I lying in the middle of the road? Yes. Oh, yes. That yes. Uh, regrettably, that was me. I I had just been mugged and in and yeah, I'd take, had a bit of an accident, so I was seeking out a doctor. Huh. Yes. Well, hopefully things have worked out for you since then. Oh, uh, it's definitely improved. I've I've done some more training with the transit authority. That's, that's why I'm trying to find. Uh, Hopefully, get in contact with them again today to do more. Right, and um, you do know that uh, you can send a telegram to transit, right? Yes. Well, I I actually forgot earlier, but uh, I did send one just before, so hopefully, I haven't completely missed them. Mm hmm. Oh, you know what? I did see. Uh, I did see somebody who was around who works for transit. His name is Victor Beckett. I don't know if you've met him or not. He's a great guy. Uh, I believe I might have his telegram information, so I, I could see if I have it and put you in contact with him, or, you know, give it to you so you can reach out. Uh, sure, wouldn't hurt. Um, I'm not sure Beckett. I'm not sure. Oh, yes, no, I have, um, he's uh, the latest name on my notepad. Yeah, Victor Beckett. Yes, I've already, uh, I believe I've already been in contact with him. I've uh, met uh, oh, okay. Mr. Booth, uh, Miss Worth, uh... Uh, and a few, uh, a few of the others. It's it's been mm -hmm. good. It's just it can be hard to uh, get out, you know, get a hold of them at the when we're both free. Right, right. Um, so you said you were looking for people from the theater too. Oh yes. Well, when I not too long after I arrived in country, some people recommended I uh, audition because of my you know. British accent and whatnot. So, right. uh, I just haven't. I've met a few. Uh, I, I think I believe, I believe I met the wife of Miss Russo. I, be I believe I met her, and uh, mm -hmm. so they're aware of me. It's just again, it's hard to uh, it's hard to get yeah, in contact with them. They're not around every day. Uh, you might have if you're around tomorrow or Sunday. You might have more luck. I feel like I see them on the weekends more often than not, or than during the week. Ah, uh, yes. Um, they're also, you know, the, another fellow who runs the theater, Siddiqui White. He is also awake usually much earlier than this. You know, maybe he's going to bed about three hours before now. Oh, right. I understand it can be difficult for some people, but... Uh, yes, <laughs> yes. Myself included uh, during the week for the most part, but... Uh, yeah, do you have their, do you have Nat's, uh, Natalia's uh, contact information? Natalia, yes, and then a few of them have mine. So I guess it's just a matter of, like, they okay. may be busy with other things. Yeah, I know that they had a production of Romeo and Juliet going on last week. I think they did their last show on Monday. How did I that go? Not, I did not go, but I'm assuming it went well. You know, I, I hope so. I usually do a stand-up job. I met, the, I met the lovely young lady uh, down at the train station one day who was playing Juliet and she seemed lovely uh, you know I don't even remember who was playing her was it Oni that that rings a bell yes and she's got a a, a, a wonderful Cajun. accent yeah Cajun accent yeah she's from the swamp 
Ah, yes. Oh, it was. She was delightful. And she had just done her hair. It looked. It looked fantastic. Mm. I thought that it was her playing Julianne. Okay. Um, yeah, but I would say if you've already reached out to Ms. Russo, then you probably just have to wait for her to uh, be back around checking her telegrams, and I'm sure she'll reach out to you. Yes, that, that's all um, right. I just the, the, my main priority is learning how to drive these trains. So it's just yeah, but it is yeah, a lot of waiting. I do see. I feel like the transit is a lot more uh, active earlier in the day as well. At least from my from what I've seen, you know, as far as trains are concerned. Um, but another good thing that would be nice around here, especially, is uh, you know, transit can control the, the tram lines here in the city as well. Oh, there, there's a tram? Ah, oh, yes. There is, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's very rare that we see anybody driving them around, but, uh, you know, when they do, it's, uh, it certainly adds a, a nice feel to the city. Yes, I imagine it's a, it's a very convenient way for people to get around. It's, and it's a... Indeed. It really shows how far uh, technology has come. Who would have thought we'd be doing anyth of anything course. beyond riding horses around? Indeed. Well, um, yeah, I would say if you've already reached out to those people, unfortunately, I don't think that there's much you can do besides play the waiting game. Yes. Uh, if, if, um, if, say, I have trouble, you know, I'm not hearing anything from theatres or transit authority over the next over the next few, is there anything you recommend? Is there anything going on around that's worth checking out? Any other shows or events? Hmm. Shows or events. Uh... As far as in the city, I'm not too sure. We we usually put on a lot of events, but we're going through a bit of a staff shortage right now. Um, you know, I, my business is gambling and entertainment. Uh, so not only do I do I run a bear steal here, but uh, also the Grand Corrigan Riverboat Casino down at the docks there. I don't know if you've seen it before. Um, and we also do uh, a lot of events through my business, the Lemoyne Gaming Association, where we do horse races, fighting events, things like that. But unfortunately, we've had uh, other business that has required required our uh, uh, the the majority of our attention for now, and we, we've had to put a lot of that on the uh, on the back burner, so to speak. I'm sorry to hear that. But hopefully, we'll be getting things uh, back up and running within the next month or so. I'll keep an eye out because I would love to be a. I I miss yeah. the I miss the nightlife of back home, and it would be wonderful to spend a night out on the town here in Saint Denis. Of course, yeah. The Corrigan Club we would usually do every Thursday night, uh, about twenty minutes before this time, about eight thirty by the Eastern Stars until about ten thirty. Um, so I'm hoping that we can bring that back. If not next week, maybe the week after. Uh, we usually have. Stellar entertainment come in and perform. Uh, nice Italian cuisine, fancy cocktails, and of course, uh, gambling. Uh, not only the table games that we have to offer, but also some unique games that we've invented that you can only play at the club. Mm. Sounds intriguing. I well, I hope it. I hope it happens sooner rather than later. That's the hope. But, uh, yeah, I'm sure uh, when we th get things back up and running, I'm sure there'll be posters all over the place and advertisements in the newspaper, so just keep an eye out. Will do. All right, well, it's been a pleasure talking to you. Thank you for your time and the information. Um, I might go see if I've got anything back from transit and hope for the best. But, uh, yes, all the best of luck with the business. Looking forward to it. Yeah, yeah, and, uh, you know, another piece of advice, too, if you have a horse, it could be worth riding around the different towns. Uh, if you know where you go to read your telegrams, there's a little office right inside on the other side of the window. Sometimes people from the transit authority will be in there. So if you see anybody oh, yes. in there, they're most likely from transit. So you could probably speak to them if you see one of them inside there. That's a very good point. Yes, I remember Miss Worth showed me that down in uh, Armadillo. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the reminder, sir. Well, I, I bid you farewell for now. Have a lovely evening. Yeah, ciao, ciao. Uh, yeah, let's, um, maybe we received a telegram in that time.
Oh, excuse me. Mm, it is seeming... It may be seeming more and more likely that my Sundays is best to be seeking out training. Because, yeah, it feels like, as you'd expect, on a Friday night, you know, people, people have got stuff on. You know, the work week has finally come to an end. They want to get out and do something straight away. Hmm. Good evening. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it's the ladies from earlier. I think. Yeah. Damn, nothing. Ladies, a pleasure to see you again. Oh, a pleasure to see you again. How has everything been since I last saw you in Blackwater? What brings you to St. Denis? Uh, we, we have a lot of things to do. I'm so sorry. We are very, very busy today. Oh, no. That's good to be busy. I hope to be busy yeah. soon, too. Keep an eye out. You might see some trains yeah. later. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Yeah, it couldn't be any better. Yeah. Come on, get in. All right. Very, very busy. The old lady's uh, lost or something? <laughs> oh, okay. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't hear you if you said hi. Uh, hello. Ciao. Hello. Oh, all good, all good, all good. Santino Vicenzo, Picere. What's your names? Eleonore. Penelope. And you? Penelope. And Eleonore. Okay, yeah. Sonny. Yes. Santino Vicenzo. Santino. That's nice right. It's Barletti. What a handsome name. Very, very handsome name. <laughs> and you? you? Oh. Well. This seems very busy. You, uh, ladies work, uh, work at the theater? No. We don't work uh, in San Jose. Well, you should. You think so? Uh -huh. Goddamn right. No. Look um, like you fit the profile, eh? Well, we, we don't work here. Where, where do we work, uh, uh, Jesus I fucking Christ. <laughs> Let's leave that a mystery for tonight. Uh, so you don't work. You don't work. <laughs> we work. So what do you do? Bartending and services. Mm. You say bartending. What are you bartending? And, and services, did you say? Mm hmm. Mm, okay, yeah, go ahead. Where yes, do you bartend? In holds. Ladies at night, love me. 
Ah, yeah, I could have guessed that. Yeah, I could have guessed that. So, Zara, there's, there's, a, uh, there's a kitty saloon. Kitty oh, power. so you know the para you know the Nine Lives Saloon? The Nine Lives, that's right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've been there on occasion. Oh, really? Mm hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah, we work there. That's right. Nice to meet you. Andrew, sir? I love that name. Yo, TJ. It's going good. Just trying to hopefully get some, uh, some transit authority training coming in. Not sure. Not sure how lucky we're going to be. Just as uh, he stands there. Mm -hmm. oh, no, 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 I'm there. I'm there. These two hey, two guys, you know, speak. Hey, nice to meet you, man. How you doing? What's your name? Look, there might be some mob business going on. Um, yeah, we might. Um, I don't know. Might go pick some oranges. Just something simple to do before maybe doing some, um, before doing some farm chores. Because the, the, orange, the oranges seem to... There's less uh, errors with the orange bringing. But how you going, TJ? You had a good week? So we're going to get changed. Go pick some oranges. Check Telegram. If still nothing, do some farm chores. Oh! Uh, actually, no. Uh, uh, maybe we'll go check roads first before we go do oranges. Because it's, cause it's close enough. Yeah, with the Transit Authority training, um, one of the senior members uh, showed Albert how to handle a firearm, the basics. And then because because Albert was mugged, I you know, went and purchased a cheap revolver for self-defense. Haven't had to use it yet, thank goodness. Just check.
Um... Maybe if we see a, um, maybe if we see a poker game happening, might join that just to listen in on some conversations and meet some more characters. Poker can be fun, even though sometimes I suck at it. Uh, it's quiet here too. Uh, is this you can get changed here, right? Oh yeah, that's right at the general store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. I haven't given anyone a bath, but we did receive our first bath earlier today, <laughs> which was uh, cursed. Is a very good way to explain it in a nutshell. It was very cursed. Very funny. <laughs> Squid's like no more bats. We are we're definitely not uh, that desperate for work yet that we are wanting to become a master bather yet. It can be, it can be hard. It can be hard, uh, you know, lining up the schedules with the Transit Authority for training. But, you know, we've got to give it time. We've got to have some patience. Hello? Is, it, is somebody using the changing room? Oh, right, I'll just wait out here. Oh, okay. I won't be much, much longer. No, no rush. All right. <laughs> I won't be much longer. Who the fuck is that? It's like some crazy person in there. Like, <laughs> Apple. It won't be much longer. They might be in there like an hour now. <laughs> Yummy.
crazy to think about how normal some of these outfits were back in the day. Like, dresses like that. And then, like, suits and stuff. Like, that's just a everyday thing. That's a lot of layers. And especially for ladies, like, that, you know, the corset. And then, like, the... They didn't just have the skirt, but then there's, like, the... The, the frame thing first, like, so many layers. Like, imagine putting on that kit every day. What a nightmare. Oh, madam, was that you in the changing room? Are you all finished? Oh. Cornero. Did she come out of there? No. Oh. Are we still all right in there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's just Jackie. I, 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 I thought I, I thought I saw someone exit, but I was mistaken. No worries. I'll still be uh, waiting outside. Too silly. <laughs> she could be there for ages. Bloody roads. Look at all that dust. Disgusting. What would you prefer? The the mud of Valentine or the dust of roads? Crafting a bomb in there? <laughs> <laughs> like cooking math or something. You, you almost finished? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do too, Mrs. Fino. I'm, ex I'm expecting like someone just completely crazy. I think that's a deputy. Looking like they're loving life. What was he wanting to use the change room? It's like, there's a line, mate. There's a line. What do you think you're doing? What do you bloody think this is? We live in a society. How long should I wait till I ask again if they're done? <laughs> Waiting for the changing room? Grabbing some peaches. Oh, no worries. All finished? So, so, so sorry about the, about the wait for fell fella. That's all right. The main thing is you're all dressed now. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. If you don't, don't mind me, I'm ask, asking him what, what do you think, think about the outfit. Oh, let me let me come down and have a better look. I think that looks good for for the uh, environments I've been traveling through here. I think that's suitable. It's you know, it's it's a uh, you know, it's formal to a degree, but it also looks like it's good for the for the country. Uh, that's kind of, kind of kind of what I was going for. Thank, thank, thank you. You're very welcome. Yeah, I, I like like your tie. Thank you, thank you. I, I don't leave home without it. Uh, I can see see why it's a very very, very nice tie. I'd, I'd wear it around everywhere too. It's it's very nice. I uh, I, where, where, I try to look it? good. Uh, when I get it, uh, just from a just from a the local clothing store back in London, uh, where I'm from. Back in London, I see. I, I ain't never been there. It's quite far away, but I imagine they've uh, some of the clothing stores here should supply them as well. I think I've seen some other uh, gentlemen around, you know, Saint Denis and such, wearing similar attire. So if you ever want to get one of your own, well, you oh. go have a look. Maybe, maybe I'll buy, buy one. All right, you you have a good good day, fair fella. You too. Wonderful to meet you. What, what was that? What was that? Oh, just nice to meet you. Oh, pl 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 pleasure. All right, yeah, you stay, stay stay safe now. Oh. They're doing the rounds, aren't they? They're everywhere. These two ladies, they're working hard tonight. You watch the moment now that I've changed into my outdoors work outfit is the uh, the moment that um, I'll get a telegram saying it's transit authority training time. I'm trying to remember, what's the... I've got like a little... Yeah, there it is. Yeah, I'll, yeah, that's what I was looking for when I was looking at him. Just a little... Little tip of the hat, like, hello! Good day! I keep, I keep, I keep forgetting where everything is on the emote wheel. Yeah, we might go pick some oranges just because it's it's foolproof, right? It's reliable. So then, then at the very least, we can say we made some money today, despite everything. We at least made a little bit of money. Yeah, I've got I've got a feeling they're they're all busy tonight. Got a bad feeling. I think it's un unfortunate timing today, but we'll see. I can still try for a few more hours at least. But he invited in to help him out with his little game. I've been thinking as well, like, because like the goal is the main goal is to get uh, regular, like, get all qualified with the transit authority. Um, and do that. That's the main work that Groves does. And I'm just trying to think. What? What? What would? Where? Where should the? Oh, excuse me. Like, where should the character go from there? What? What could? What would a character like this be after? I'm just trying to think. Like, it'd be awesome to be involved with, you know, people robbing the train and such. But I'm not really sure what else I'd be striving to do. Uh, did I leave the horse up here or did I flee it?
Oh, that's right. I left it down there. That's right. Well, if I was going to do a lawman, I would make a new character with a different background. For sure. I'm just trying to think, what else would I do with groves? Oh, yeah, because I've been in the, the voice channel so they can see me. I sent a telegram to the tip line. I hope there's nothing else I've forgotten to do. Oh, we're actually going to need some crates by the looks of it. Maybe that one. Deliver 20 oranges to the St. Denis Cathedral. Might just do a simple one. Because we don't want to be too committed to something too crazy in case a transit thing happens. I had a lot of fun playing um, I played a, a round of Age of Empires 2 with my mate Late Night Liam and some others um, the other night which was really fun because I haven't played a, a decent game of Age of Empires in ages so I really got the uh, the urge to to play some more <laughs> Play some more this weekend. Because there's a whole. They've added so many uh, civilizations to the game, to the definitive edition, and I still haven't even played as all of them. 
And I've barely touched the campaigns. I just bloody forget about them. I'm getting Rule Britannia stuck in my head again. But that might be... Because yeah, I'm sort of... The, the plan is to play as Albert Groves until... Um, until I go do stuff at PAX Australia and South by Southwest Sydney in October. And then after that, uh, potentially make a lore character. And it's seeming like that might be a good idea because... I've definitely seen more lore around than... Like, it's... it's they seem to be around more often... There seems to be more of them. So just with my time zone, it just might work out better <laughs> to do more with them. That is the, the hard part about playing on a server where there's so many different people from different time zones and I've only got so much availability. What is that over there? Is that a turtle? Is that a snapping turtle? I think it's a snapping turtle. Some of the videos of them are scary. <laughs> hey, Tom Boy. Hey, you going, dude? <laughs> uh, I just need one more, one more uh, orange. I nearly said apple. <laughs> It's been good. It's there. There can be some real, as you expect, there can be some real quiet moments. Um, there can be some really interesting moments here and there, which has been amazing. Uh, started doing some transit authority training last week, which was nice, but it's hard. I haven't been able to get a hold of them today, which is a damn shame. Um, it's been good. It's just, it's just the the time difference. May make things a little tricky, but it's been good. How you going? I already asked. <laughs> Me brain not work. It was 20, yeah, 20 oranges to the St. Denis Cathedral. We're doing our part. You know what those orphans need? They need oranges.
Oh, I'm going to the cathedral. Where am I going? I'm like, oh, I gotta go check my telegrams out. Like, no, not yet. Gotta deliver the... Gotta deliver the oranges, mate. What are you doing? Dum 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 dum. What a hero. What a hero. May the orphans never go hungry again. I'm out of the way. I'm all done. Oh, thank you, miss. Uh, still no. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Um, nothing yet. So let's go. Let's go see if we can actually finish an Emerald Ranch chore without breaking the chicken coop. We might run into some more familiar faces there. Oh, oh I cut that in a section a bit too much. That's that could have ended badly. That would have been on me. All right, emerald. Ye old emerald.
Good morning, Shelby. Oh, well, good day. 11.35 already. What? What the fuck? Where's the time going? I know, I just, I feel like we're entering the... We're in the midday now. <laughs> How's it going? Chillin. Charlie has a potential adoption viewing today. Oh, Charlie seems like a really good cat. And like, that's great. That's great. He'll be up for adoption. But he seems like such a, from what I've seen and what you said, he seems like such a well-behaved cat. It'll be, I hope you'll be all right when he goes. How it's going well? Unfortunately, it's it has been a bit quiet today. Uh, it seems that the Transit Authority senior officers may all be busy. Um, we are we have not seen any Transit Authority related activity today. Uh, maybe just the bad luck of the draw. But we did have our first bath, which was a very cursed, funny experience. We nearly got robbed again. That was a time. And, uh, but now, yeah, we're just trying to kill some time. We went and picked some oranges. Now we're going to do some, uh, ranch chores. To just, you know, make some money and then hope that, uh, kill some time to hear back from the transit peeps. Yeah. That's right, it's just how it is sometimes. Get out of here. Let's see. What have we got? We'll go with the little one. So hopefully there's less room for me to break things. What do we need? Oh, we... Well, right, we're going to go do the chicken related stuff first to ensure it doesn't break. Oh, please work. Please work. Or am I doing something? Like, is it me? Am I doing something wrong with the chickens? Maybe it's all my fault. There's currently no chickens. Currently no chickens. What do, uh... When do they come back? <laughs> the goats are assholes. Everyone knows it. But please do try to refrain from killing them out of frustration. Give them a little push and then hold the gate open. Usually they run out. Blah, blah, blah. Usually they run right out to join the cows and get distracted by them. Remember to shut the gate after. P.S. To feed the chickens, scatter the feed, then wait until the chickens start to approach you, then move away. They don't like company when they're eaten. Approach, drop feed, move back, and let them feed. Thank you kindly, Emerald Ranch. Oh, that makes sense. But the new problem is that. There currently are no chickens. This is a chickenless farm. Um. It would be a server thing, right? Like maybe there'll be no chickens until the server resets, or if, if I quit. And re-logged. Would that save the chickens as well? 
Is that... Is that a, could that could that be a thing? Huh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I just want to do transit things. Then I'm thinking like, do I... Like, do I just do the, what is it, the, the cow milking and the sheep shearing now, and then tomorrow do the chickens? If they respawn, but then... But then I just gotta hold on to that job until then, like, I can't do any other jobs between now and then. But then if I cancel this one now, I, 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 I still can't, I can't do anything for like half an hour. Unless a transit thing comes up. Oh dear. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Um... I don't know. I could go and learn how to utilize the crates and stuff, do those jobs that require the oranges to be crated up and delivered around the country. But then as just one person, that could be a bit slow. And I probably have to hire a wagon. I don't think you can... Because I think the crate goes into the wagon. I don't think... Like, yeah, I think you got to have a wagon. So then I'd have to rent a wagon as well as buying crates. I think maybe I want more money first. Just in case it, um, something goes wrong. So any other jobs really is oranges and that. So we, yeah, we might get, yeah, we'll get the cow milking done, the sheep shearing, and then, and then either by the end of today's session or, to, or tomorrow when I log on, the chickens will be there and I can get that part done. We'll try that.
Twitch release, thanks for the follow. How you going? I'm going pretty good. Oh. Oh, I can't look at horses, so you can look at them. Good evening. So, Appaloosa. Uh, I don't really like Appaloosas. I want to. I fucking love Appaloosas. They're so fucking pretty. <laughs> uh, would oh. you happen to both know where oh. the chickens are? Uh, yeah, I can show you. It's uh, so if you go over by the. Oh, um... I know where the coop is. It's just oh. uh, I popped over there before, and there appears to be no chickens. Uh, you. Yeah, so you'll start working for them. You go to the barrel, put your name on the list, and they'll bring the chickens out. Oh, the chickens will make. Oh, yeah. I see. All right, mm -hmm. right. They must be. They must have been having a, a bit of a rest before. Yeah, you you just throw some feet out, and usually they come. All right, I'll try that. Thank you, Miss. Yeah, of course. We'll be here for a couple minutes longer. So if you still can't figure it out, uh, we can try to help you more. I'll, I'll head right over once I drop off this jug. Thank you. Yeah, no worries. Of course. Right. That's what I want to... Yeah, we're just... Um, we're doing some uh, farm chores around the... Uh, at the moment, release to um, kill some time. We're hoping to hear back from the Transit Authority to continue some training, learning the trains and the wagons and whatnot. But my main uh, concern is... Uh, the last two times I've tried to do um, farm chores is that I always seem to break the chicken feeding thing. I don't know if it's me or the game. It might be me. <laughs> so she reckons the, the chickens will appear when I start the task. Let's give it a go and pray. So everything else is fine, like shearing the sheep, had no trouble with that. Milking the cows, I've had no trouble with that. But seeing the chickens. Oh, and there's a goat in the pen again. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, hell. Oh, they're not going to start causing trouble until I start feeding the chickens while I it. They could not give two shits right about now. All right, let's try. Oh. All right, I've sent, thrown some feed. And then, then the note says, back up. <gasps> They're eating. Oh my God. It's a Christmas miracle. Whoa, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, God. Oh, okay. Come on.
Right. I think we're in luck today. I don't know, TJ. It, I think it came from... It, like, phased through the gate from over there. I think it wanted some of the chicken feed. So get out of here. This is for the chickens. This isn't, this isn't bull feed. Fully feed four chickens. So we're going to do this four times and then the chickens are good. Oh, right on the goat. Uh, excuse me, sir. <laughs> excuse me, sir. Make it rain. You better not get in the way of these chickens. I swear to God. You damn goat. Howdy, Gazzolzo! Hey, Dawn. How you going? Oh, don't you dare. The goat's eating all the chicken feed! That's not for you, that's for the chickens! Well, I think they need some more feed. Coming right up. Whoa, look out. Yes. Eat. Eat. What, you going for a walk, squid? What's going on with this not George fella? Well, today we, we're just really hoping to, to hear that, um, to get some more training in, but the transit authority, but what it, it's, um, I don't know if any, oh, no, 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 they, 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 they let the chickens out. Oh, yeesh. They let the, the goat and then the chickens run out. Ah! Oh my god. Will more chickens spawn? You shit. Oh, get the fuck. The goat heard and he was like, not George, huh? I'll show you. Can you... Can you not? This is a nightmare. Um, but yeah, we wanted to, we were hoping to do more transit authority training. But yeah, it, it it may be bad timing. There may not be anyone around to do that today, which is unfortunate. We might have more luck tomorrow. So we are just trying to kill time. Uh, we've just been popping through like Saint Denis, Rhodes, Valentine, and then doing some odd farmyard activities, and just hoping for the best. <laughs> <laughs> like I've been told I'm a fast walker but then the other people are just like zoom oh they need more feed there you go enjoy yeah I've learned the trick is yeah you want to drop some feed and then you want to walk away give them Give him some room to eat. How does Albert feel about pink ponchos? Uh, he is neither for or against them. Uh, he has not had any negative experiences with pink ponchos yet. <laughs> All right, we actually completed feeding the chickens. Let's go. Now let's shear some sheep. Coming to get you. Let a thousand blossoms bloom, as far as I'm concerned. Albert Caddick grows. You're welcome to try, Gazdozo. 
But I got time, because if you want it, you gotta you gotta apply for this one. You gotta wait weeks for a for your application to get checked, so so I got time to build up a pink poncho resilience. I'll have a pink poncho shield ready. I am I am really enjoying the server, but the hardest part is not knowing anyone. It's a which is both a blessing and a curse because it's exciting because you don't know what you're gonna get, but then it's also like, man, I might not run into anyone that wants to interact. Hey, which can be a bit brutal, but that's life, I suppose. Do some of these sheep on shearing? You could not have tried harder to be less... You could not have tried any harder to be less... For your character to be less compatible of being a potential friend for George Hughes. I have watched the Bob Catter video of him saying that way too many times. He lives in my head rent free, as the kids say. It was like, oh, my friend Gazozo is going to start playing on the same server as me. That'll be nice. Makes a character that's like the opposite of mine. That's fine. That's fine. I didn't want to play with my friend anyway. It's fine. It's fine. I don't, I don't mind. <laughs> it's cool. It's fun. It's alright. Didn't want to play with my friend anyway. No, I don't, don't even care, eh? Hey. <laughs> it's alright. It's like taking a friend to a party and then they ditch you and they just go hang out with everyone else. It's fine. It's alright. I don't mind. It's okay. It's <laughs> No worries. <laughs> I'm just gonna milk some cows. <laughs> Just pretend you're like Morpheus showing Neo the door to new friends. I find that that, that is definitely... Um, if there's one thing I'm really good at in life, ever since like school, is I'm a great... I'm great at helping people get to, to places they need to be. Like the amount of people... The amount of people in my life since school that have become friends or or started serious relationships or have come across great opportunities in that just because they just happen to know me and I introduce them is insane. But it's very common that then um, it's it's very common that then it's like um, I seem it's I don't know it's not intentional but I, I just seem to get I seem to get forgotten a lot. That's fine, though. It's fine. You know, it's fine. It is what it is. It just... It would be nice if... It just would be nice if I was the person... That people wanted to... To meet. But it's fine. I'll be the... One in between. It's fine. Haha. <laughs> Someone's got to do it. <laughs> got to milk them cows, move them jugs. Dan knows everyone, though. Dan knows everyone. And Dan gets everything he wants, one way or another. 
So Dan can deal with it. <laughs> it's all right. I get it. I I can be a bit. I can be a bit dull. And pessimistic, and I can be a bit of a downer sometimes. So I get it. I'm I'm not exactly a lot of people's first choice of someone to to hang out with. So I can come across as quite a depressing chap, which is understandable. And I like to keep to myself. So it's. I only have myself to blame. <laughs> You'll never go to GYG with anyone else? Oh. And like I've said before, Gazozo, like, I, I really do apologize if it comes across that I only ever invite you to things when there's a new movie. It's just I don't go and do stuff. I don't go and do stuff, and I don't really... It's not like I have this amazing house where I'm like, yeah, people come hang out at my house. Like, I don't, I don't go and, like, apart from work breaks, I don't go and grab coffee. I don't go and grab lunch places. I don't, I don't, like, where I'm currently living, I don't go and do stuff that, that is exciting enough to be, like, inviting people. I don't have things to do. I just, I, I, I don't, it's not that I don't want to hang out with people or talk to people. I just, I just don't. Where I'm currently living, I just don't have stuff going on outside of work and streaming. It's it's frustrating, but it's like, what can I do? Well, I'm I'm glad I'm glad in a way, Gazozo, because I really I really hope I don't come across as like, well, he just invites me to go see movies like when when it's convenient for like movies, and it's like I don't mean it to be like that at all. Truly, I don't. I just, I just don't have. It was just so much easier when I was younger, because like it was like, oh, let's go grab lunch while we're waiting for our next class at uni, or when I was, because I, I was doing, um, I was playing bass guitar and I was doing it, helping out on a podcast and I was helping out on a web show and I was doing this and I was doing that. There's just there's lots of things to be going on to be meeting people and to be doing things. It's just now it's just I go to work, and I come home. I just. It, and I just, I haven't really seen anything locally that I'm like, oh, I want to commit to that. Like, I, I know there's like some gaming shops where you can do like Magic the Gathering and tabletop games, but I'm not really into that. Like, I spend enough money on video games. Like, I don't need to be spending, wasting all this money on cards and fucking miniatures and shit. I just, I can't afford to be doing that. Ramble, ramble, ramble. Well, oh, that's good to know, Zozo. That is good to know. Because I, I, yeah, I, I hate coming across as rude. I don't mean to be, I think. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Then we'll go back to Valentine and see what's going on. Holy crap! There's a snake right there. I don't even know if I got it. No. And there goes. Now I have two bullets. One for me, one for the horse. Hardy, hardy, hardy.
Yeah. Get out of the way. Do 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 do. <laughs> that was that was equivalent of it was it squid? Ba -bum 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 -bum. It's very sad today. We haven't run into um. Oh, Mrs. Phenom, are you still there? Can you remember the name of the the crazy guy with the mustache or Hagalan? Ah! Or Hagalan or anyone? Can anyone remember the guy we were speaking to in Valentine last week who was really intense? Drew something. Well, yeah, we haven't run into him today, which is a shame. Makes me sad. Drew Peters! That's right. Drew Peters. Yeah, we haven't run into him. Makes me sad. I hope he's living his best life. <laughs> Goodness. <laughs> no. Get out of here. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Are you all right? Fuck. Uh, fuck. I'm so sorry about that. I didn't realize my horse would come. Listen, don't go drinking it yet. I gotta give you instructions, all right? I'm gonna take you to the medic, man. I'm so sorry about that. Shit, he's fucking unconscious. As hell, I'll be back. Uh, here you get a as well. Miss, just uh, like I said, just don't drink it right away. I gotta, you know. Ah. 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 <laughs> yeah, you know I'm doing all right. Ah. It's been. It's been quite interesting waiting here. There's been a hell of a lot of things happening around here. There seems like it. Is there a doctor in the house? Uh, not to my knowledge. Is there anything I can make it up to this chap with? I, I'm terribly yeah, sorry about maybe. my horse. Here, hold on a second. Do you know any medical attention? Because uh, I, I got to get going, and I hate to say it, but I can... Uh, you could maybe take an eye a care of him there. I can certainly try. Yeah. Yeah. I give it a shot. We I wish I could help. Um I don't know if you can hear me, Mr. Peterson, but I still want to talk to you about that. Um so I don't have your telegram, unfortunately, so it's I'm gonna have to find you again later. But Oh he's are you are you are you getting gaining? Was that a breath? Oh god. The labored breath. Yeah. Um. Can fuck such a fucking shady situation right now. Uh, uh, how, all right, he's gonna pick you up. How do I do uh, that? Navigation. Um. Just to you know, you gotta check and see First, what kind of injuries he's got. the circus going. freaks come here selling cream. Then a deranged lunatic who can't control a horse. <laughs> I yeah. do apologize, old chap. All right, we should probably go. Uh, Mr. Peterson, I'm going to be I'll back. Be and I'll be in touch with you, okay? contact with you. Okay, sounds good. I hope you feel better and get well soon. Oh, God, the pain. Mr. Peterson, is it? Yes, it's me. Hello, my name is Albert Groves. Uh, again, I'm terribly sorry. I will do the best. Uh, uh, how do you feel? Like I just got hit by a horse. Uh, yeah, well... Uh, do you, do you need uh, CPR? Do you need a glass of water? Or don't you dare lay your fingers on me? <laughs> well, I, I certainly won't. It's not my goal, but I, I do. I, 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 it wouldn't be very gentlemanly if I didn't help you back on your feet. Is it? Is there anything uh, I can do for you? Do you need a pillow? Oh, uh, well, a pillow would be nice. But let me uh, let me go check out the back to see if there's any. I'll be one second. Oh, it's locked. 
One sec, let me uh, let me ask out on the street. <laughs> now, when the cream hits your tongue, do not panic. It will be thicker than anything you've ever drank before. And as it slowly runs down your tongue and begins to fill your mouth, you be careful of letting it spill out of your cheeks. You don't want that. We're not here to waste cream. Now, as it fills your mouth, you want to relax your throat. You need to relax. It um, nice what? And wide. Because this cream is going to slide down there. It's going to take a second. Mr. Peterson, are you still with me? <laughs> there doesn't seem to be anyone out there that may uh, be packing a pillow. And you get a doctor, Dan, it, or someone that can help. There's just someone, um, uh, I think they're showing off, like, milk or something. Yes, the circus freaks. I don't care. Look, uh, the, the gentleman that dropped you off here, he gave me a medical bag. Would you Would you happen to know, be able to walk me uh, through helping you? No, if you... If you Check me over. Have a, have a look at my forehead here. Right. Yeah, you see, you see if you can. I know, wipe the smut off. Give it a clean. Well, it, it feels stable. It's a bit muddy. But your forehead seems to be in check. Yeah, yeah. Oh yes, it's. I suppose it's. Uh, it seems seems a little bumpier than the average what forehead. Oh, that rook is. Miss Peterson, please stay down. There's a there's a fight going on. What is the rook is? Uh, oh, Jesus Christ! What the bloody! Watch out for Mr. Peterson! Oh my god. Oh my god. Gee. Oh, he's back up. Not anymore. Crap. You please help me, ma'am. <laughs> Are you yes. a doctor? But what's happening with you? Uh, Mr. Peterson, he he was hit by my horse on the street. Oh. I was given a, a medical bag, but I, I have no idea what I'm doing. I have no medical training. No, it's okay. I'm going to see if I can... But, but keep your voice down. Please. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, the other people are just sleeping it off, it's fine. There you go. Uh, thank you. Poor man, is he gonna be okay? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, he's fine. Me. Does it feel better? That horse sent him oh, flying like 30 feet. Player. It was wild. Wait, hold on. I'm, I'm going down. Hold on. <laughs> Does it feel better with the cold glove? Yeah, it feels nice. I don't think there's much I can do besides of that, to be honest with you. I don't really know what's going on outside. Uh, oh, the circus of... came to town. I see. <laughs> all right, let's uh, help you up, all right? Three, uh, two, oh, one. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. 
you. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry again, old chap. You know, there's one thing you can do to remedy this. Yes? Go out to the circus selling cream and call them all circus freaks. And then we'd be square. That's it. I suppose if that's the price I have to pay. So the the wagon out on the street and be like, you're a bunch yeah, of I want you to I want you to say, hey, everyone who working for that cream business, I, I wanna say something. And then wait till they're all there listening in and go, you circus. They freaks. already wrote off. Shit. They just wrote off, yeah. Oh oh but is there anything else I can do to make it up to you, Mr. Peterson? And that next time you see them, you call them all circus freaks. All right, I will do my best to do that for you, Mr. Peterson. Again, I am all my right. sincerest apologies. That's okay. Everyone gets one. Then it's personal. Oh, one of, one, of, oh. one of them is up again. Right. Oh. You better behave, oh. mister. Oh, get out of your way. Agreed. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your night, Mr. Peterson. So how did, uh, it, how did it happen? Oh, like, he was, he was hit by your horse? Oh, this deranged man doesn't know how to control his horse. Him? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, guilty. Oh. Guilty as charged, man. But everyone gets one. Then it's personal. So, so what are you guys uh, doing at work rise? Oh, I came here to sell an Onyx. And I'm just trying to uh, keep an ear out for any more uh, training with the Transit Authority. They're entrusting oh. you to, to drive trains. Oh, I'm, it's, I've got a very rigorous training schedule ahead of me. Oh, it'll be fine. Wait, you're with Transit? Uh, uh, just as of last week, I started training, and I'm hoping to do more today. I, I, guess, I guess you... Excuse me when I say that, I guess I didn't expect... You You look like you're working on a farm. Oh, yeah. ranch. Oh, yes, this, these are my uh, outdoor working clothes. Um, I usually dress a lot nicer than this, but people suggested that they were wondering, why the hell are you working, milking a cow dressed like that? So I went and bought these fine overalls to... Uh, to not get uh, dirt on my suit. Uh, see, so, I, I'm a respectable businessman. I see. So, are you already hired on then as transit, or...? Uh, no. I'm uh, just a trainee, uh, currently, I believe. Does that mean they pay or not? I'm always really confused at that. Well, I, I have not received a single paycheck yet, but, oh, I but see. that's all right. I've done two ride-alongs on trains, but uh, yeah, hoping to make uh, a third ride-along today or tomorrow. Oh, I love trains. They're lovely, aren't they? How would, nice they would it be to look out that window and see a train coming through Valentine? Oh. But I haven't seen, I haven't seen one all day. Valentine, they would be cursed. <laughs> How's it gonna get off the tracks and run through the main street? Oh, not literally, like uh, not down the main road, just uh, along the, the the railroad through town, uh, the, over by the uh, the train station. Huh. <laughs> You're a strange man. Oh no, I'm English. Have a question. Wait, were you the, were you both the whole time in Valentine in the last I don't know, one or two hours? Huh? Uh, were you both in, in Valentine like I, I don't know, uh, the last one or two hours? Uh, I pretty much got here when the people said and cream came here. <laughs> Let's see. Hey, is it I, was I see. And I came from, uh, I was over at Emerald Ranch uh, feeding chickens. Uh, and then before that, I was uh, picking oranges down in the uh, swamp. Why did oh, you ask? Oh, no, I was just curious. 
because there's so much going on while I was in Valentine. I kind of just wanted to know what, you know, if anything happened while I was gone. I live here. Oh, uh, man, nothing really. Apart from my right ear, people showed cream. A horse uh, yeah. decided to headbutt me. I saw a naked man earlier on playing trumpet. Was that Mayor Cabbage? I was here early on. There's, there was a man. I got a bath earlier. And then there was a man, a naked man, hiding behind the divider, singing a song. Oh, my God. And then oh. I, I saw him around town naked. I think that's Mayor Cabbage. Ha, huh, interesting. Huh. Apple? Well, uh, all right, well, you guys have a taco. great day, yeah? You as well. What was your name again? Uh, Albert Groves, at your service. Well, Mr. Albert, instead of calling on those people, circus freight, how about them? Yes. I get a free train ride. Sure. Well, I, I don't know how long it will be until I am qualified to run the trains myself, but certainly, yes, I, I think between now and the end of time, you can request one free train ride from me, certainly. All right. So we can square that away. We're even. You know, you know, you could call upon that free train ride whenever you'd like. Sure, sure. Wonderful to hear. Again, I'm so sorry. Oh. I, uh, I only just learned how to ride a horse, I think, last week or so. Right, right. So I don't well, really know what I'm doing. I can't tell. But you interested in buying a gem, possibly a curse? A, a, a cursed gem. That's how the story goes. What, 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 what would the gem do for me? It'll cost you five thousand dollars. Five thousand? I, 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 I certainly do not have five thousand dollars. I'm afraid. Well, I hand mined it from Guam. Allegedly, people say it's a cursed jam. Oh, uh, but if you know you you need to turn your money into an asset in case someone comes to snoop in. You let me know. Uh, I guess. Yeah, I'll I'll keep that in mind. Yes. Well, very well. Very well. Anyways, I'm going to ride my horse, not into people, but over to Tumbleweed or Armadillo. <laughs> All right. Well, safe travels, Mr. Peterson. Yeah, yeah. Actually, do you know your telegram? Uh, yes, it is. Um, uh, Let me just remember real quick. It is uh, VM808. VM808. Zero eight. Yes. Well, I'm going to send you one so we can remain pen pals. Sounds good to me. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, you take care. You too, Mr. Peterson. See you next time. Oh, I will. <laughs> yeah, probably I want to see your horse. <laughs> oh, shit. It's a shame the circus, the, the cream people left. That would have been very funny going down, just being like, You're all a bunch of circus freaks. That would have been very funny. That's a shame. That is a shame. Um, what is the, what is the time in America right now? So on the east side, it's 10.30 and on the west side, it's 7.30. So something may come up. I just wish I could know a little in advance because I'd hate to wrap up and then suddenly find out that 
something happened right after I left. But it's only 12.30 here, so I could do another hour or two just to just to be sure. Just trying to think. So we haven't got any more leads with... Um, the theatre. Nothing from Transit. Um, what's some other things that Albert Groves has been made aware of? Like, we did some orange pegging. We did some farm chores. I don't really feel like doing any mining at the moment. I don't really feel like doing that. I'd rather do some stuff where there's more people around. So we'll get changed and I'll think about it. Just, yeah, Albert doesn't really know anyone else yet. Or of anything else going on. Oh no, what am I doing? Not the shop. I want to go to the change room. That's here, I think? Yeah. That is one of the main things I really enjoyed about playing as a lawman because like when you don't have anything on the side to be doing, you can always fall back on, well, you know, you go on patrol or you go and, you know, just ask just about anyone, you know, how are you going? Like, have you seen anything weird happening in that? Like, that was always good to fall back on that. So playing as a, a civilian can be cool but it's, it's times like this it's like what do i do what do i do i just don't know um maybe go back to roads like roads in roads in saint denis seem to be apart from valentine they seem to be the most logical places for groves to go um you need to skate well, skate with the horse yeah that's what oh. they said oh was that her sure. oh. we might head back down the roads in saint denis Growler. Yeah, oh.
on the road to Rhodes. I better not repeat the same thing. Oh. Uh. Is he laughing? Please don't run into anyone. Is that a law or a gang or... I don't know what's going on there. <sighs> Still no train. Any transit stuff's happening today. What the hell's my keyboard doing? Keeps wanting to go to the left. Oh, there we go. Wait. No, 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 no. Wait, 
You get where? Oh, okay. Just want to buy the creeper to fucking kill him. Yeah. All right, let's 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 just let's just get the end. Fuck you know. Whoa, that's the stuff right there. More cream. Bro, howdy there, man. I want to buy some cream. We lost we lost money, Nick. Blackberry. We need all the cream. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I meant they were chunky cream. Right? We need to remember that order. You want to buy some cream? <laughs> uh oh, yeah, that's what you get. We got one more delivery around here somewhere. Oh fuck, it's literally right there. I just stay mad and I quickly deliver this last package. Where the fuck is Harley? So I shouldn't do it on company time. Desperate need of another bath. Maybe there'll be some stuff at the Rhodes bathhouse and we can see what... What one there is like. Jesus. It's almost like I... Fell over into the dirt. The hell did I do to get this dirty? Hey, mister. Good day. You want to buy some cream? Cre what, what sort of cream? It's the best kind of cream. It's the Kerrigan's cream. Is it for... Uh, is this for consumption or for your skin or what? What's it for? It's for consumption. You got to... You got to tilt your head back and, you know, open wide. Let it glide. That's what they say. It's that good, huh? That's right. Delicious. One sip and... uh you know, some say it's like getting a hug from your grandma. Oh, that's quite nice. How much is it? That's the best part. It's whatever you can afford. Yeah, we're practically giving it away here. Oh, what about what about three dollars fifty? That sounds that sounds great. You got yourself a deal, Joel. Now listen, there is uh, there is some instructions. There is some instructions. Now, when you when you drink this, you know, you're going to want to take it with both hands, all right? Oh god. Yes. Take both hands. You got to you got to tilt your head back, you know? Make sure your the back of your neck touches the, the back of your head. You know what I'm saying here? Oh, sorry. Oh my. Oh. Sorry, I was putting my pipe away. You know, that was actually the next step. Then you got to hit someone and sorry. then Sorry, old chap. Sorry, just thinking of the milk and putting my pipe away is a bit of a 
reaction. Yeah, Sorry. After that, after that, you gotta, you know, you gotta let it glide down your throat. Make sure not to, not to waste the drop. So, and that, and that's it. Yeah, and uh, also, um, you know, it may cause, it may cause uh, injury or death, but we are not liable at uh, Kerrigan's Cream. Well, what's in it that could cause death? Well, it's just, it's a little thick, so, you know, some people that are not uh, properly equipped to, you know, drink the cream, you know, amateur drinkers, amateur cream drinkers especially, um, Jesus Christ. it's not recommended that they actually, you know, they drink this, they could die, or choke, or, you know. I suppose accidents do happen. Yeah, but we are in no way liable. It is uh, not legally uh, binding or, you know, whatnot. Well, is it, uh, should I drink it right away or should I save it for a special occasion? You know, there uh, there has been reports of uh, some improved, you know, tastes. If if you leave it, you know, let it age a bit. But it's, it's up to you. Depends how you like your cream, you know? Oh, well, I... Excuse me. Don't really. I suppose I might save it for a little bit later before I get maybe just before I go to bed. Yeah, it's you know it's best. It's not good to drink before you go to bed. You want to drink it, you know, when you're on your feet still. Yeah, you don't want to be lying down when you drink the cream. There, you fucking choke. Well, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna drink it in bed. Just before I go to bed. Yeah, why don't you lay have a little sip there? This is a, it sounded like he wanted. Yeah, I mean, to just let it free bottle. He, he sounded like he wanted one me to just let the bottle. whole thing glide in one go. Come on, here, take this bottle, friend. <laughs> what is going on? Go on, let it glide. Yeah, let that Make sure one you glide. read the instructions, though, because if you don't, it can go horribly wrong. No, yeah, he, I told he, him a little bit. He gave me the, uh, he gave me the, the low down. All right, we're going. Well, we're now I've got it. two. I'll have one now. I'll have one later then, shall yeah, we? Yeah, I have a perfect. Yeah, there look you go. Yeah, you got yeah, two free that. samples. No, he paid for the first one. Oh, that's good. Oh, let me make sure you down the hatch. instructions. Oh, they, good, good, oh, good. They get, yeah, spread that shit. <laughs> yep. oh, oh, fuck. All right. Get it down. Get it down. Bit. That's good. That's good. Get it down. Get it swallowed. <laughs> Let it glide. Oh, my God. Yeah, oh, no. Oh, no. Let it glide. Come on. 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 Oh, God. Oh, fuck. It's happening. Oh, no, 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 no
can always go to Blackwater and uh, Blackwater and bathe yourself. That that might be the better option because that I had a bath at, in Valentine earlier today, and I I don't know what to make of it. Did they put spiders in it? No, there was. Um, so a gentleman was helping me bathe, which was fair enough. And then there was a fellow dancing. There was a man who was a rug. And then there was a mare behind the divider uh, playing a gramophone, singing about bath time. Huh. And then they well, uh, they drew the negative energy from my head by throwing uh, this yellow powder in my face. That's oh. vastly different from the baths I'm, I'm used to hearing wait, them wait, selling. Wait, this man threw powder in your face? He has like this yellow powder while uh, the mayor stood behind me with his head above my head and he, he was chanting something to draw the negative energy from my my head. Yeah. Huh. C -c -c Could you remind me of this man's name? I'm sorry if you didn't mention already. <laughs> um, the, the man from the... The actual establishment, I can't remember his name, but the man behind me, uh, Mayor Cabbage. Hmm. Never mind. Different individual than I was. There's a man who's also going around injecting people and uh, throwing a bit of powder in their face, and apparently it's got some sort of um, uh, abilities of suggestion. Oh, oh, what color is the powder? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, uh, there's, it's, it's... A, I don't, I, I, I don't know. Just, I would just watch yourself. There's just a strange man who's just, you know, try, trying to be like a, a friendly and lurey and trying like a, I see. Oh, okay, uh, uh, oh, before, well, before, well, good luck before, with that next bottle of cream, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Uh, before we go, uh, can uh, we get uh, your name and telegram real quick, just so that way, in case, uh, you know. Absolutely. Uh, Albert Groves. Mm -hmm. My telegram is VM808. All right. Thank you very kindly. No, it's thank you. Good yesterday. Pleasure. <laughs> All right. Uh, you also have a fantastic, uh, you also have a fantastic uh, choice of fashion, my friend, I must say. Thank you. It's the old craze back in London. Oh, I know. That. That's right. I said black water to bathe yourself. I think that might be the the better option. <laughs> oh dear, dear, oh dear. There's some there's some very sus characters on today. The the sus the sus characters have been unavoidable. <laughs> Like the bath, and then the people selling cream. Bloody hell. I'm like keeping an eye on it because I'm like, is this, gonna, is this like, is this gonna enter like Twitch TOS territory? Like, holy shit. Like, I always feel like being like, guys, I got a twinkle in my eye. Just... I don't know what you, where this is going. Did she, sh did she say what she was doing? Like, I'm up for a laugh, but. Wanna be careful the Twitch TOS. Bloody hell. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, that's a that's a good reason to go to back to Blackwater. <laughs> Haven't spent much time there is Old Groves on Wild. Maybe she's inside.
Come on up, <laughs> Wearing the horse out. Oh, wrong turn. <clears throat> Excuse me. Good day. Fucking boat with hat. What are you doing out here in Blackwater? You fucking saying the need for some bitch? Uh, I was told there was a good bathing. Uh, facilities baby. here. Well, you insinuate I'm a baby or some shit. You fucking insinuate. Pardon? Are you insinuating that I'm about to bathe you, Boulder Hat Boy? No, that they said there was good facilities for one to bathe themselves. Yeah, yeah, one bathe himself. I don't work here, but uh, I think right upstairs. Right upstairs. Upstairs? Upstairs. Yeah, there's a bathtub. You can go scrub a dub dub here. All right, I'll go have a look. Thank you very much. Yeah, no problem, oh, no problem. Oh, excuse me, sir. All right. Thank you very much, sir. I don't mean to keep you. <laughs> Hang out for a little while now. Hang out for a little while. 
There doesn't seem to be a bath upstairs at all. What's your name, Fancy Pants? Albert. Albert what? Groves. Albert Groves. What are you doing down here? Oh, yeah, you were looking for the bath. Shit. Sorry, fella, I'm neck deep in the whiskey. You know how it goes. You know how it goes. Oh, yeah, it's just, yeah, there's no bath upstairs. Is there one downstairs? I don't know. Maybe ask this fella. He'll spit in a bucket and scrub you, maybe. I don't know. Hell, I don't know about no bath, but uh, there's water spigot outside. I suppose that might have yeah, to do. Yeah. Oh. You got a rough oh, naked yeah. around here, mister. Here's bath time. Oh, yeah. Damn right. That song was called Bath Time. The people in Rhodes said there was a great facility here to bathe oneself. They, but it's out they on the street. They were joking to you because they were lying to you because the cat house gives the best baths. They give you a great old bath. Hey, there was no one there, unfortunately, and I, I was did wasn't going to dare go back to Valentine for another one of whatever that was. <laughs> Where are you from, mister? Uh, uh, England. England, okay. So wh where's this, uh, what do you say is outside of water, uh, water what? Spigot. Spigot. I'll show you right here. Right here we are, mister. What is this, a spigot? Right there. All right. Yes, sir. You just yank on that pump there, and there you go. Got you some water. All Watch right. Yourself up. There's a bucket right there as well if you need to uh, fill it up. All right. I suppose this will have to do. Uh, I'll quickly wash off while it's quiet. Of course. All righty, mister. Well, I got to run down to the bank real fast. Now, you have a good one, all right? Thank you. Of course. <laughs> Oh. Do, 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 do. What are you all right? Pardon? Uh, sir. I'm just quickly uh, just running the, the, the water over me real quick. There, there's no bath facilities at the saloon here, so the gentleman suggested I use this water spigot here. Um, I feel like I'm pretty sure that there's a bathhouse somewhere around here, or at least the hotel has some amenities for search. Are they, I had a look upstairs. There's not a single bathtub there. Oh. Really? In Blackwater, there's not a bathhouse or anything. Well, I, I asked the, the gentleman in, in the in the tavern there, and yeah, they said there might be one upstairs. I had a look. There's not a single one there. And uh, so they suggested I quickly just, you know, run some of this water over me here. Oh, well, all right then. Don't catch a cold, all right. It is, you know, it does get quite, uh, you know, nippy out at this time. Oh, it's all right. I've just got to quickly just run the water over me, and then I'll... Chuck my kit back on. It'll only be a moment. All right. You try to stay safe, okay? And, um, I don't. There's a fellow inside the tavern. I think he's, uh, quite dangerous. You might want to watch out for him. Oh, the, the, the chap at the piano? No, well, I, they were standing near the piano, but, um, there's another one in there. Oh, another one now. Well, the first chap I spoke to at the piano, he, he was quite uh, rough around the edges, one might say. Did he have a handlebar mustache? Uh, I didn't catch it. Hmm. I, uh, I didn't have a good look. Maybe just his hat was very big. Hmm. Well, in any case, I'm just, uh, just as a warning, if the fellow is who I think he is, 
Try to stay away from him. His name is Walton Dandry. Dandry. If you ever hear, yes, Walton Dandry. If you hear that name, just watch out. Ah, oh, will do. Thank you very much. Yes, you're welcome. Mate. Try to get dry, all right? That's all right. I'll pop the clothes back on real quick. All right. You always have a good night. You too, sir. <laughs> I was almost expecting like the law department or something to come right and <laughs> come by. Like, what are you doing? Well, we can talk about that, so. Hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. Would you care oh, for a drink with us, sir? Um, sure. I just uh, just uh, had a bath outside, so I'm all squeaky clean again. Keen for a drink. That's that's great news. You're, now. That, uh, you're that fellow that was waiting on me in the clothing store earlier, aren't oh, you? Oh, yes. Hello again. Hello. What's everybody oh, drinking? Yeah, I'm whiskey. Drinking Irish. Wait, 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 wait. What did you say your name was, fella? Name. Uh, Both of you, actually. Walton. Oh. Uh, Walton. Well, this is Sasha here. Uh, Sasha. Uh, uh, Marlon. Like my fucking Sasha. Looks like a bit of me. Yeah, I don't know. You can follow something. Sir, have you maybe drinking some bad whiskey or tobacco lately? Excuse me, I'm just gonna grab. I think he might be. Some drinks and stew. Is oh, it? Sorry, fella. Sorry, yeah. fella. Is this Mr. Dandry? Your your voice is very uh coarse. You, you need a lot of lozenge, fella. Dung me. No, no, this fella with the with the lopsided hat. Oh, right. Front front lopsided hat. Does anybody want a medical bag? Just to have or am I paying for it? They can have it. Take it. All right, she'll take it. If you'd like, Mr. Dandre, I've got this uh, this wonderful cream. You're welcome to it. It might help with the throat. Is that any better? Oh, that, yeah, oh, yeah. that sounds wonderful. Would you still need yeah, to drink more whiskey? Yeah. I, I was going to say, I thought I was a beautiful sounding man, but you're, you're making me doubt myself now. How do you know my last name? Uh, you just said it to the, the chap here in the suspenders. No, I said my name was Walton. Oh, uh, word on the street. How do you know my... Who the fuck are you, boy? <laughs> you some loud dog, is that what you No, mean? no, I'm from England. I'm not I'm not part of the law at all. I, a, a gentleman outside, when I was having a bath, he suggested, oh, uh, there's a Walton Dandry in there. Oh, yeah, Walton Dandry, huh? You know what they say about Walton Dandry and Englishmen, fancy pants from out east, don't you? No, what do they say? They say, put your goddamn hands up, fancy fuck. Oh, oh shit. Um, um, walk up, okay. stairs, boy. Walk up them stairs. But there's no you bath. Learn how to be tough, boy. There's, I'm not trying to be tough. I just was trying to find no. a bath. Quiet, quiet down. Well, you're going to get a real scrub down in a second, son. You're going to oh. get a real scrub down. I didn't mean any trouble. I know. Uh, I just, I just can't stand when rich folk like yourself all fancy pants living up down here. You know, just I'm not rich at all. Fine I, land. I'm not rich. I I spent last of my savings on the boat to get here from England. Now, what do you do for work? Well, I'm I'm currently training with the Transit Authority. With the Transit Authority. Huh? Yes, I, I currently don't have any stable employment. I, I guess I spent all my savings to get a ticket to come and get a boat from England to here. Mm -hmm. Now, are you, a, are you a good fella or are you a bad man? Just trying to do a law-abiding job for this moment in time. What are you? I, I, I really just w would love to drive trains. Ever since I was a small boy, I just would love to be a train driver. I do like trains. Well, fairly nice. 
I tell you what, I'm driving a one-way train in your fucking pockets right now to see what you got, okay? <laughs> we'll, see, we'll see what you got here. There, <laughs> I was giving some... not a rich man. Got a $151. Yeah, I was, I was working on the Emerald Ranch earlier today. Well. Don't look like a rancher. No, I'm not. Ranching isn't my first choice. I'd much rather uh, drive trains, but it's just, there's been no training today, so I've had to go and do, pick up the odd job. No training for the trains. I'm yeah. not uh, all it's evil, fun. you know. You're a hard-working individual, it seems. Oh, get, you know, get your I'm hands out of my to... pocket, sir. What are you, what are you <laughs> doing? Are you getting my buck to right I now? think you're in no position to make the man, 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 man's foul fella. I don't think you are either now. What you're going to do is, and I did the last fella that we were here, funny enough, another Englishman, just like yourself. Something about you folks and not being able to hold your own gumption just gets me turning a little bit, you know. Hold my what? Folks. Gumption can't hold your own. Scared to grip a pistol, you know. You just can't. You're not up to the tails. Well, I've never, I only just learned how to hold a gun last week. Yep, and that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> now, you're going to go stand directly in front of that fire pit right there, okay? Well, I suppose I do need to dry off from the bath. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now, you're going to sit down on that ground, and you're going you're gonna to dream into that fire about all your conducting hopes and dreams, okay, while we make our eluding escape. You want me to sit down by the fire? Sasha. Sit down by the fire. I don't want to do this. Sit. If you can. If your knees ain't up to the task, you're all right. Don't worry about it. Uh, how do I do it? How do I do it? A sit ground F2. Uh, is that all yeah. right? That's more than acceptable. You're sitting down, ain't you? I suppose. Now, your name's Albert, right? Yes. Now, what are you going to take away from this, Albert? Uh, well, well not, not that $70. Yeah, that's for what? one and... You ain't shit, Albert. I want you to remember that. You fellas, you Englishmen coming down here. Not even just Englishmen, oh. you know, just fancy pants people coming out here, getting closer to the West. You know, I don't really like it. I, I think I think it's but, fine. But I, I wasn't even rich back in London. Right. I was, this is what we no, wore in no. the war, working class. Yeah, well, the working class is for schmucks. You got to take what's yours, Albert. What the hell do you think I'm doing? I had you eyed up, clocked from the second I walked in. I knew what I wanted, and I knew you fucking had it. Well, that's not very nice. Life you know, I ain't nice, Albert. And Life I was ain't nice. And here I was about to offer you my cream. I don't want no Albert cream, okay? The only cream I used to like was my mother's hair cream, but I just got out of prison, so I don't even got no use for no fucking hair cream, okay? I'm a dangerous individual, Albert. And this boy behind me, okay, he's a goddamn killer. If you even tried chasing after us, so help me God, our Lord Almighty, I'll sick this boy on you like a dirty old German shepherd, okay? They wouldn't do that! I almost killed a deputy because he talked back to me. What? All right. Oh my god! Yeah. I almost I, 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 I drowned him in the river. What? Jesus Christ! I was there. I just got out for extortion and kidnapping. There, Albert. Oh my! I, look, I don't want I any more trouble. I, I, I just wanted to find a bath. My middle name's Trouble Albert, and you fucking got it. So you're going to sit here, and you're going to count down from 60 to zero before you depart this fucking bar. If I even smell your little fucking biscuit must come down that street, I'm turning around, and I'm coming for you, Albert. Do you understand me? I, 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 under, I understand. Don't raise your voice, Albert. Do I, you understand me? I, I understand. I, when do you want me to start counting? Get to the stairs over there, okay? Okay, I, I can do that. All right, all right. Now, 
If you see Sheriff Manius when you're reporting this to the law, like I assume you will, tell him Walton says hello, shall you? I'll try and remember all that. You don't got it if you don't need to. You're a little shooken up, but we're going to get out of here. You have a blessed day, sir. I hope well, your day gets better. You be my new Bobby. <laughs> 60? 59? 58? 57? 56? 55? 54? 53, 52, 51, 50, 49, 48, 47, 46, 45, 44, 43, 42, 41, 40, 39, 38, 37, 36, 35, 34, 33, 32, 31, 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Goodness gracious. Damn, I knew I should have banked some money. <laughs> of course I run into another criminal. <laughs> Hello, Sokra. You're not wrong, they were coming. Hello, have you seen any lawmen? Oh, oh, Are you no. Oh, no, wait, we didn't do, we didn't do nothing. No, I've just it, been robbed. Wait, just, I was just oh. wondering if you've seen any lawmen. I've just been robbed. I've got to report a crime. We, oh. we just did that for you. We heard it all. It was horrible. Are you okay? Oh, I'm, I don't know. They they made off with all my money. Oh, my goodness, Jethro. We've got to give him something to help him. Oh, okay. Hang on. Let me look in my satchel. Yeah, you look in your satchel. We already telegrammed the law for you, mate. We walked by. We they're they're on their way? Or well, maybe I don't know. I it's hope it, so. I gotta, around. I gotta tell them before it's too late. Yeah, well, we, we told them, but I mean, maybe another telegram could help. I don't know. Oh, it's kind here of, you it's go. Busy, you I, know, Friday night. You here? You have, hold out your hand. Yeah. That we told the other people in town so they didn't get hurt. It was three Lincoln peeps that got you. I was gonna it? stick. There you go. You you just have that in case you can sell it or something. Oh, thank you. Was this garlic on a stick? Uh, it, it, oh, I could. I guess it could be if you put it on there. Oh, it, let's give it. A, um. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's pretty good garlic. See? Yeah, man. make you feel better, mate. Yeah, it's, yeah. So, it's all the tum tums. Appreciate the gesture. Uh, oh, there's, there's no skin off of my back. <laughs> yeah. I found it in the bin. Really good in here, anyway. <laughs> in the bin? Bin garlic? Yeah, it's the best, mate. <laughs> oh, I you know, there's four bins in black water. You should have told me that first. I would have run that under the water first. 
Well, who, who the hell just eats it whole? You're supposed to peel it. Oh, yes. Hey. Yeah, silly. So if I, then it does matter. What's the tip line for the law again? Is it just law? Yeah, mate. Yeah, law. <sighs> L A W. Oh, well, I might, I might send a uh, a telegram as well, real quick, just so I can make a report about this. Uh, okay. About this fellow. Thank you, though. Uh, uh, okay. Where's the telegram station? It's around the corner, mate. You want us to show you? Uh, yes, please. Yeah, let us escort you. Yeah. Here you, you go on ahead. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> we saw the criminals. They went this way up the hill. Nasties. They definitely left town. Yeah. There were some There's three of them, right? We saw two men and a woman leave. Yes, that was them. Oh, yeah, they went up that way up that road. Yeah. Real Lincoln people. I can't believe yeah. that. That was very yeah. rude of them. I'd like to play the table up there. That's a really rude place to do it. There you go. Just go in there to the right. Thank you very much. See, I'm going to get like a telegram away something. right now. Okay. Be careful, mate. Law. Albert Groves. Robbery in Blackwater. Good day. What was his name? Walden? Walton? Walton Gendry? What was his name? Walton Gendry? Um... I think that's all they really need. I suppose they'll they will um they'll reply if they want more information. Walton Gendry? God, I'm getting... God, I'm bad at remembering names now. <laughs> a bunch of garlic and a bunch of sticks from a bin. Just compensation. God damn it. That's funny. Oh, dear. Damn, that's second week in a row we've been dropped. <laughs> oh.
Oh, shit. That's funny. <laughs> oh, dear. Dear, dear, dear. Where's the gun store here? We need to get some more bullets. Let's try it down there. Oh. There's that damn cream van again. It's per bullet, isn't it? Oh. That was neat. I saw he, um, he, like, took my gun and knife and that off my, off my belt so I couldn't, like, use it against them. While they were, um, escaping. Which is neat. Alright, so we got... Some... Loaded gun again. With some spares. Ooh, <laughs> Nearly got taken out by that horse. Hmm. Still no sign of any transit staff. Yeah, I don't think there's any... It doesn't seem to be much sign of any... Transit Authority people, so... Might call it there for today. Um, well, even though we got robbed, at least we still made a bit of a profit. <laughs> and uh, can try again tomorrow morning. When we might have some more luck. Of some more Transit Authority training. I think. <laughs> 